this week on Clown College. Hello. What up, this Charles? Hello. What up, Charles? What's going on? Man, shit, chilling, man. Look, man, I call you. I got a, a group of guys. I got a group of my partners, man. Listen, I'm at a uh, community. It's called. <laughs> Clown Community College, bro. And we want y'all that. We want to see what it takes to get you on the podcast, man. I'm going to shoot you my manager number. I bet. Man, We they All sitting right. here listening to you now, man. They it, It's a mixed group of guys, man. They love you, bro. All right, bet. I'm going to shoot you my manager number now. I bet. All right. This is the best day of my life. Oh, my. <laughs> this, is the best day. this is the best day of my life. Oh, Fuck shit. Yeah, my life. That's crazy. Man, man. man. Oh. <laughs> That's what we needed, dude. I told you about that was connected. Would you just know him? Yeah, I know him. Welcome to Clown College. We have profound knowledge. In many ways, the elevator make you sound polished. So if you want to, hear a little honest. A few takes on a ways to make it as a comic. Then stick around for a while to fit down the clown. We got the guests right now just to show you how. Let's all go to Clown College. They got some fucking hitters over there. I'm, I can only play quarterback yeah. though, and they were locking that shit down. Good. It's cool. Yep, it's cool. Remember when Georgia beat TCU 65 to 7? No. That was an embarrassment. That was like two years ago, three years ago. It's the largest margin of victory ever. Mm. 65 to 7. That's not on if you want to. 55 to 7. I'm not putting my headphones on because I'm scared of spiders, dude. Oh. Well, you think they're in the, air, the headphones? They could be, man. Nah, man. You're all right. We, we, you we know killed what? them. Or you're right, Brandon. Them. I shouldn't be a pussy, dude. Hey, yeah, man. They get in your ears. They're going to get in your ears regardless. Don't. Well, let's not. Okay, well, yeah, let's not think that. But you know what I mean. It's not that wasn't thing. comforting, Brandon. No, that was. I, yeah, that I actually creeped comfort. my ass out, too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now it's on. Damn. Sorry. It's all right, Brandon. Damn, Brent. I still love so why you guys why, why are you guys scared of spider? Right. Dude, there was a fucking behemoth <laughs> tarantula, as Brandon described yes. it in here, dude. Yeah. That thing was fat, bro. We'll throw up, we can throw up the picture, right? Wetland uh, wolf spider. Yeah, dude. <laughs> the giant wolf spider, dude. Yeah, dude. Oh like Brandon came in, he's like, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh yeah, man. I Look at that out. thing. Dude. Cause I almost stepped on it. I just looked down and I was like, oh, hold on. Damn. Like, hey. That hey, dark tarantula. one. Yeah, right there in the hand. Dude. You got that a tarantula in this bitch. That's what it was. That's terrifying. Yeah. Dude. That's horrific. I ain't gonna lie, it took me back a little bit. Cause I'm not really scared of spiders, but that motherfucker was just sitting there. Luckily, we put a cup over it. And because I accidentally hit the back of it and all its babies start running out. So I had to I had to spray right there, sprayed all the babies, and then we gassed them out in the cup. Oh yeah, yep. really good. He stayed alive for a long time. Oh Dude, yeah, he was the running fighter. around in there for like five minutes. Yeah, which is too long. Yeah, yeah, yeah too long. Too Way long too for long. how much spray we put under a that decent cup. Decent amount of spray, yeah. like I, a good amount. Dude, like probably. 30 seconds of spray. Oh, yeah. Exactly. And multiple times, too. Yeah. Because it kept on moving around. Gosh, dude. I didn't want to open the thing up, and it just ran away. That's a shame. Mm -hmm. Imagine if you didn't have the cup. You know how many times you would have got bit before that thing just fell over? Oh, well, if I'd have stepped on it, like just regular stepped on it, mm -hmm. all those fucking babies would have. I mean, there's no way I could have contained them. No. No, it was too many. Uh, there would the not shower. have been a podcast. <laughs> I would have left. <laughs> we would have had to record in like you know a McDonald's or something. I don't know, dude. The library. I don't even know where the fuck you go, dude. I would have been lost. That was horrible. For Forty years. That, that was bad. Yeah, it was, it was rowdy. 
Right, it got, it got us a good jump since we came in. Shit, hell yeah, woke my. It'll ass wake up. you up, dude. Mm-hmm. Like smelling salts. Yeah, yeah. 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 We need. Oh, we, ooh, should, we should get those. Yes, dude. we should. Brandon, we should order definitely. those right now. Yeah. I want to see how much I'll they cost. I'll give you my card number Man. live on the podcast. Yeah, we'll do it, dude. Hold on, because that seems cool. <laughs> kind of fucking ad was that? That seems cool. Let's 21. see. Let's get the twenty-one dollars. Twenty-one, right? Well, let's see where you can. Is there any on Amazon? Oh, why is oh, that yeah. one hundred and sixty? Amazon, yeah, that's better. I don't know. Just not no random dude. Named Ted or something. Let's what? Yeah. <laughs> Biden dropped out. Nuh-uh. Stop joking with me. Biden Biden let me see. Out of the just, Biden just dropped out of the election. Who's going to be the Democratic Alexa. nominee? Dude, I don't know. This is dude, live, dude. What the hell? Uh, Newsom, maybe? Uh, Jack just texted me or something. He just email. pulled out. <laughs> Biden dropped out. What? Ago. Oh, damn, man. Biden just pulls out. Because he's fucking has oh dementia. He had to go. Damn. What? Wait, but they don't no, have a chance of winning the, now. They don't have the a chance. Who's it going to be, dude? I don't think they Damn, know yet. Damn, man. Hulk Hogan comes out, scares the shit out of the office. <laughs> man, what the fuck? <laughs> man, Hell dude, you uh, understand. My gosh, he, dude. That was crazy, man. Hulk Hogan When he came run. out there, ripped that shirt. I'm not a, I'm not a Trump cool. fan, but. Did you see that dumb when Hulk yes. Hogan came out there, uh-huh. it, the, I saw the Twitter post where it's like we're almost at idiocracy. Yes, it would have had uh, a Terry, Terry Crews. Crews almost. There ain't no almost. Hmm. President Dude. Biden has to Then okay, so Holy Trump's shit. gonna be the president for sure. Oh no, yeah, Who, no doubt. I I mean he pretty much had it after in the bag after you know Hulk mm-hmm. Hogan he bossed up. No, yeah. not Hulk. <laughs> Man, I, I don't think that. <laughs> I don't think having a guy who's <laughs> who said the N word during a sex tape. Oh yeah, that's bad, man. Not <laughs> great yeah. publicity. Maybe with I don't know. Actually, oh shit! Uh, damn. But Why, they don't have dude? a chance now because incumbent president has the the best chance of winning by far in in history. And now people were even if they thought he was old and all that shit, they didn't be like he's safe. Now they don't have a chance. I don't give a fuck who they put up there. It's good. It's in November. You think it's gonna be Kamala Harris? Fuck. I don't think they no. like her either. D- you you can't. She will get demolished. Oh yeah, really? But yeah. Well, who are you going to put up against them? You, Nancy Pelosi. You want to know the only real? You don't know the only <laughs> real person who could go up right now and have a chance. Who? Hillary Clinton. Damn. It's the only one. It's because it's, you know, Hillary. You know, she says some things and she was right, but when then and then he got president, right? And then everybody's like. Damn, we should have just voted for Hillary, but people didn't like her. But now, I mean, who else? Who else has the name? Who else can can fire back with them? Obama. <laughs> yeah, if Obama can yeah. run out. But his term's over. You know, it's going. It would have to be somebody like that, which you Michelle know, Obama. Kanye West, dude. I'm like, no. You know he actually. I mean, actually, might. Would be he dead. actually might. Well, I mean, Who he knows? he would we would we would be in a nuclear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, After well. that, but you know, it'd be why fun. drag it out? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? It Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Could you imagine the the Who music that you go run? out to whenever you're about to die? Oh, the rock is about shit. to hit. He's gonna have a banger on there, dude. Man. <laughs> you playing flashing lights while y'all getting man. <laughs> lights. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> dead man. That's so good. Oh man, this I can't wild, believe man. this is wild. Oh, hold on. Oh. Oh. Let's see. I can read it for y'all if you want. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah let's do that. <clears throat> Hold on. Mm-hmm. President that. Biden has decided he will end his re-election campaign, he said, mm. in a statement released Sunday. A decision certain to send shock where... Wait. <laughs> there is another <laughs> spider. Well, oh, shit. Hold up. Where? Where, dude? Right here. It's a smaller one. Oh. Like, that is crazy. <laughs> Oh yeah, man, dude, there's a lot of them in here. I'm sorry, I moved this camera. Hold on, man, my bad. I had to this is so much is happening right now. I'm overstimulated, this man. Is little, this, is little. this is the same one, though. It's the same one. The smaller. Holy Wait, shit! Where is it at? You're safe, over. Brandon. I'll let you know, dude. Hey, man, if it's moving this way, tell me. I got you, man. So, uh, this is overstimulating. Everything that's going. And it's there's terrible. so. Out. This is a spider pops up and almost bites us in the ass. This is... <laughs> Dom, you gotta call somebody, yeah, man. Here. I'll spray it. You gotta call it. Ghostbusters, oh, man. No, I got this. Look, we gotta make sure. Okay. Yeah, you can just grab that one. That one's not that crazy. I'm sorry. Oh! Oh, oh Brandon, oh, run! Oh, shit! Oh, damn. Hold on. Oh, man. <laughs> hey. That one was quick, bro. <laughs> yeah. oh, oh, man. Gosh, dude, I'm gonna cry. Yeah, let's 
That's what I'm saying, dude. You got to call the authorities. He was going that way, dude. dude. This is the apocalypse. Fucking Biden's out there with plagues of It's the fourth spider I've dealt with today. That spider racist. Not well, dude. Probably in the hundreds if you want to count all the babies that came off that fat ass. Oh my gosh, that was probably a teenager. He probably came looking for his daddy. Oh yeah, and then he saw me and he was like, "I'm going black on black crime, kill this motherfucker." That motherfucker almost got away too. (laughs) Oh, he almost did. Came straight this way. I'm sorry. Man, I'm no, glad you're y'all good, got him, dude. Man. That's yeah. the least of my worries, right now. <laughs> dude. The fact that you got that spider, I appreciate it, man. Tom, <laughs> you're old that enough to run, dude. Up. Why don't you join? Uh, jo- join what? I'd be eliminated. Democratic nominee. They're, they're just gonna bring up uh, one clip. <laughs> man, I'm over. With, I'm over. <laughs> what, what type of clip? Yeah. <laughs> where, where you're like Hitler wasn't that bad. Yeah. <laughs> Literally. Like, oh, really? Huh? <laughs> dude, shit, you might be Trump's vice president. <laughs> oh man, that'd be crazy. What I really meant was <laughs> like trying to explain that. <laughs> <laughs> Metaphorically Yeah I'm saying he did bad things <laughs> There's no denying that yeah. Oh hell yeah Horrible I just, I just think I don't know why this pops up On my news uh, On my Twitter feed But uh, like Hitler in a cape They were like You gotta admit Hitler had aura That's what the post said <laughs> You wanna see a picture Of Hitler so in a cape That's a very Gen Z <laughs> That's probably a Gen Z The thing whole aura thing I hate that dude Let's see if he I hate, That's idea. so That's so lame bro Hitler in cape dude it look in a cave like Darth Vader, huh? Go to Just him. like Darth Vader. I mean, look at that. Look That's, at that right there. That's hold on, here's a better one. About. Look at that. Oh, Ooh, he posing with I mean, you. I'm gonna, whose whose face should I insert over here? <laughs> 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 we, we, we know who it is. Oh, snap. Jake. Yeah. <laughs> a colored picture of it. Oh, I see that. Hey, hey, them boys was fresh. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, <laughs> the boys was fresh. Dude, oh, no, Louis, Louis Vuitton yeah. made their, and Versace made their uniform. Really? Dude. Yeah. Oh, uh, see. Yeah, That's still crazy. wearing that shit. We just, we just cut that out. Oh, damn. I like how we pull up Hitler right when we're talking about Joe Biden. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is what to expect. Right? This is crazy. Uh, so, oh, who are you guys voting for? Not me. Can't. <laughs> Dude, I, I don't know. See, I only know about two people, man. Yeah. The Biden and Trump thing. Well, Biden's out now. So, I'm not are you going to. for anybody. I so, guess. are you voting for the Democratic nominee or the Republican? I'm going to sit out this one. Sit out this one? Because I don't know. Like, it's like I, I don't see any good options mm-hmm. right well, now. Well, there might be a good option. Yeah, we don't know who. Oh, well, I mean, if somebody pops up, like you said, what, Hillary Clinton, mm-hmm. Bernie Sanders. I don't well, he's know. too he old, man. Yeah, Ber- Bernie's just, is he, is he just as old as Biden? Or he's in his 80s. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Gotta be. At least he's he more went spry, on Rogan. though. Damn. He was on Joe Rogan. He, yeah, yeah. And that he, bird landed on his podium that one time. That was cool. <laughs> Damn. That's aura. <laughs> Yeah, that's a horror, man. Because a bird landed on your podium. Yeah, yeah, that was cool. That's way cooler than Joe Biden falling over, dude. <laughs> Much that's cooler than a Or it's like shine. Yeah, <laughs> that's like shine. Who? Aura. like that's like what you put off. That's your vibe, yeah. dude. Mm-hmm. That's your Hell energy. Yeah. That's mm-hmm. what's up. You shine. Hell yeah, man. Mm-hmm. It's good jiggy, to jiggy. have. What's your aura? Sweat. My aura, man. Of course, man. That's, that's all I do. <laughs> I don't, I don't, how, how do you define an aura? What a philosophical, this, yeah. this episode is going I, I off just, the rails. I just got, I was like, how does that even work? How do you? What, the aura? How yeah. do you describe it? Yes, how, yeah, how do you describe it? What do you, what do you uh, bleed out? What, do you, what what comes off of you whenever somebody vibe? meets you? Yeah. Hmm. That's a good ass, I mean, I, I mean, sweat, anxiety. Overwhelming uh, autism. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Date, I, movie I, I, dates I, I Make them laugh mm-hmm. Make them laugh yeah. Funny Humor Yep I think you come off as Sweet Green And uh, Funny I, yeah. yeah That's it Yeah. I sweet green that. funny dude. Yeah Sweet green and funny yeah. But you know weed, that right? begs the question Who are you man Are mm. you who you think you are Are you how other people perceive you Ooh. Are dude. you defined by your own act You know sometimes I never really know If we really think about it Do man. we ever know dude? No Do we That's what this universe is about Not really knowing and just finding out mm-hmm. Fucking That's around what, yeah, and finding exactly. out Exactly yeah. Cause you can't go into space And find out You're gonna fuck up yeah. And die 
Well, yeah. blow up. You can't even go into the ocean. How we get the space? You go to the ocean, uh-huh. you're gonna die and fall and blow up. You can die on the. Wait, hold on, hold on. You gotta go to the ocean and fall and die. And blow if you up? go deep enough, because you remember what happened the with pressure. the pressure. Uh, oh, the okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just blow up, implode. Eyes come yeah. out and shit. Yeah. Fucked up, the pressure. Yeah. yeah. Did you see when they like catch deep sea creatures on uh, <laughs> on like a charter fishing boat and they reel them up real fast and they're like fucking exploded? Mm-hmm. Ooh, Their yeah. eyes are like off. It's really sad, but yeah, yeah. Sad. I, I don't laugh. At Hopefully, those we see that on Twitter sometimes. Right, you know, some exploding fish. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you still on the Twitter? Uh, nah, <laughs> you know, you got off nah, of it. I know. I mean, I still hop on there to see what's up, but not really like mm-hmm. I used to. Yeah. I mean, it's still good stuff on there to watch. Uh-huh. You know? It's not good for your it's soul. It's not good for it's your not, soul. It's not. It makes you. It makes you. It's like armor, I guess. You know, shine. So when you see it, you're like, oh, okay, that a- happened. Have y'all seen the video? It was it was going viral on Twitter like a week ago. Where the woman's in the Dollar General and she's filming the guy and he's running out and she's like, he just nutted on my leg. Oh, oh yes. I saw that. <laughs> she just, yes. <laughs> he like jerked off on her leg and ran out the store yeah. and they still can't find him. Yes. And oh, dude, it was so fucked up because all the replies were like, why the fuck is she crying? <laughs> like they were angry at her. <laughs> That's fucked up. You ain't so, you why are they angry at her? Up? She just got, huh? You mean search this up? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Dude. <laughs> on girl's leg at the grocery store. Nuts. Dollar Tree. <laughs> it's probably ejaculate, but it's gonna turn into the Bryson sci-fi show. <laughs> Let's see. Oh my <laughs> gosh! It. Look, look, look at this. Look at his shirt. It's not going to. Yeah. Lick it. It's not Jesus. going to lick itself. Oh my oh, god! Now why this would Jeremiah Cotton do that? Dude? I like. Look, uh, look, look how they got. <laughs> why would they blur it out? Go back. Go back to that why picture, dude. Right there. Oh, this one. The one you just saw. Oh, right yeah, in. yeah. I like how they, I like how they circled his uh, hairline in. Oh right there. shit! Hold on. <laughs> they was like, any nigga with a cut like this will definitely do some now, devious shit. I'm fucked then, right? Nigga, that's the. <laughs> <laughs> right there, you, you, <laughs> you're defined by your own action. Yeah. You don't right. have to do that. Then. Yeah, I'm saved. This man got the blade haircut, though. <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on. And he's the what is it? Philadelphia Eagles. That's what's. It's that's EDP's good, right? brother, dude. dude. <laughs> Oh, damn. I can't believe he's he so just jacked off. Man, Look, why just... they got nutting in quotation marks? <laughs> what the kids refer to as nutting. She took a picture of it? Man. No, she was videoing it. Oh. That's when she's outside and she's filming him run away and she's, and she's crying. And she's like, you nutted on my leg. Damn. It's really bl- fucked I'm up. I'm just surprised how they At blurred the it out. Dollar Tree. They say all publicity is good publicity, but I don't know. Yeah, I, I mean, know if you go to one. Dollar Tree, dude. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It's always a gamble. You never know. It's part of the game, dude. Did you see that the Dollar Tree in Huntsville, one of my coworkers was telling me about this. They just got in trouble because they were scratching the dates off the milk and people were getting sick. Oh my no God. way. Yeah. Whoa. Was it Sparkman? Yeah. Like the one there, Sparkman? I don't I don't know. I think it's the one on University. I don't know for sure, but Damn. I did. They were like scratching the expiration dates off the milk. That's crazy. Or putting different ones on there. I, they have like milk that. at Dollar Tree? Mm. Oh yeah, oh, dude, and steak. Everything. You can get a real steak from Shut there. Shut the fuck I'm, up. I'm dead it's meat. serious. You can get meat. No, I'm serious. They got like, hold on, let me show you. Dollar Tree steak. I will never buy it, but I've watched a man eat it. Who would you watch eat it? Oh, somebody on YouTube. I, I would. Uh, yep. Dude. Wolf Pit. Holy shit. Yeah. Yeah. I love you so much. I love you too, man. I love you, <laughs> I love you too very much. Yeah, okay, so look at this. Bar. Look at that. There's no way that's why, real. Okay, why the fuck is it in like a fishing and bait And this is what bag. it looked like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hold on. Here go a better. Here is a better. That does not look good at no, all. No, I'm not Why happy about it. Why is it brown and green? You can't eat steak from there. No. Oh, and no this way. is how it ends up. Look, you just get that little. <laughs> 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 get some sardines. Oh, my God. That's Jerry. That's fucked up. It looks like a really fancy restaurant, dude. Damn, man. Oh, my God. Oh, oh shit. He did it right, shit. though. No, he didn't. Dude, I'm not. I'm you not. Can't you can't do this right. You can't eat right. that. You can't eat that. Oh, I would never. <laughs> I can't believe this is real. Next week, dude, this <laughs> yeah. is what we're gonna eat. Why don't yeah? Everybody can. It's like a class party. Everybody can have half a bite of steak. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. Dollar steak is crazy. <laughs> yeah. They like put like Sharpie as the grill marks on this. <laughs> yeah. thing, dude. It's so gross. That's fucked up, man. <laughs> like you gotta cook it in, like motor oil. It's gonna be good, man. I used to have milk from the Dollar Tree. Like I would get their birthday cake milk, man. They have, they cake, yeah, yeah, it's really good. Like, if you ever go there, I would still recommend that to anybody. So you won't eat steak, but you drink milk that's birthday cake flavored yes. from the Dollar Tree? It is, it's, it's amazing. 
birthday cake milk. Dude, at uh, at lunch for I went to a Dollar General and got hot pockets, right? Actually, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm this, actually. I've I'm seen at, this brand before. They sell it at Subway, dude. Exactly. For real? Yeah. It's all right. The Subway's going down. Well, it's going down bad. It started really? a while ago. Yeah. It's six dollar, six inch. Jared. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I don't know which was which is worse. Once dude. Jared left, it all went downhill. <laughs> exactly, man. I remember being a kid. No, I'm just kidding. You fuck what? Jared. You fuck Jared. Man, I was just joking. But you liked him as a kid. Other well, kids but, did too. Of course, because before you knew, you didn't know shit. You were like, man, this is Jared, dude. And then when you find out, you're like, well, fuck him. Yeah. Fuck if we man. found out Brandon met Jared from Subway, <laughs> dude, I mean, that would nah, make my life. Be crazy. <laughs> I would, there would be nothing that would make me happier than that. I mean, he met Magic Johnson. I mean, Jared's not out of the realm. No. Right. If you can meet Magic Johnson, dude, you can meet anybody. Yeah. I believe so. We'll, 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 Jake the Snake Roberts next, man. That's next. Yes, I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get something set up. It's oh, harder than, than, you, than you would think to get a hold of Jake the, the Snake Roberts. Line, man. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. You gotta, you gotta meet fucking, you know. What Kane first? Yeah, now what? Kane, you could meet Kane. He's the mayor of Knoxville, Tennessee, right now. Yeah. Oh shit. So he's the mayor of fucking Knoxville, yep. Tennessee. Yeah, dude. Yes. And somebody we know banged his daughter. Mm. Hmm. Yep. Can you say? Can I say it? I'll leave it out. Okay. Bang what? Kane's daughter. He told me one time. Yeah. yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. That's gonna be a long bleep. I wonder. Oh, yeah. That. Yeah. Bleep that whole thing. No. I wonder how big is Kane's daughter. She's adopted. Oh okay. Oh, let's see what if we can find a picture. Fat? No, I was saying like, like huge, like tall. tall. Like you Kane's, seen Brock Lesnar's Kane. daughter? How tall is Kane? Oh, oh my gosh. Brock Lesnar's daughter looks just Dude, like him. Look at Brock. Look. Oh my oh, yeah. gosh, bro. Yes. Wait. Yeah, but here's <laughs> Kane's the same person. Right here. I, okay. I don't. I don't know if that's the one. You know, but yeah. Yeah, but look right. up uh, the girl that you remember. Look up. Uh, I don't know what team. I think it might be like the cheerleading team at Ooh. Baylor. The video of that girl I oh. sent you on Instagram. Yeah. Naomi. Yeah. Are you talking about wrestling? No. Oh, no. Man. This no, is like happened? college. Like the girl that plays for Baylor. Look up Baylor volleyball. Maybe. Yeah. Dude. Oh. Just look. Okay. Okay. Just look. I sent you a video a while back. But um, right here. Current roster. Okay, current roster. I'm trying to be nice about how we look this up, dude. <laughs> Any of these? No. No. You'll know. Okay. <laughs> Click on the <laughs> NCAA right there, maybe. No, just put put like what are they? Pull them up and see if it should scroll through. Yeah, just okay. go just go to all. Okay. Hold and on. actually look at the roster. All right, yeah, right, right there, right Let's there. Let's see. They probably got pictures. <laughs> Come on, there we go. All right, tell him when to stop. Brandon, you'll know. <laughs> you'll know, dude. Damn, what it, it has to be the one without the photo, right? Well, yeah, imagine. Like <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, are you? Oh, <laughs> wait, you see? <laughs> I thought you were saying. Oh, now I know who yeah, you're talking dude, about. Dude, she looks. She legit, literal anime character, like crazy. Hmm. I, it's not. I have a feeling it's not going to be on here. Damn it! Why are they Let's blocking just, them all just up? Just put, put put what you want to put in. Uh, how Look you up. describe her? Hideous. Oh my god! No. <laughs> okay, ugly volleyball. What? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, ugly volleyball. Ugly Baylor. Baylor. Because I wouldn't describe her as ugly, but other people would. Because right? <laughs> oh, she's that's like a horrible. <laughs> <human being. laughs> Dude, it's a unique build. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> go to image it. Some sliders all the way. To File the civil lawsuit. All right. All right, here we go. Up. That's not. Is that Dwayne Wade? Where? No, that's not Dwayne Wade. Oh, I hate they, when they. Uh, just this remember might this be for a one day, huh? Remember Baylor this for hit one day. with more ugly allegations. What? He said, "Remember us for one day." No, on the thing that keeps on popping oh, up. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We've covered a lot of ground in this. Yeah, episode. dude. We, we jumped. We jumped around a lot. Well, that's not, okay. She's not this is a lost well. cause, man. Yeah, yeah, we yeah, just, yeah. I'm yeah sorry. We'll, we'll just Remember take this part. Yeah, just cut this shit. Just cut, the cut, the part. Part. cut the part where I said hideous. Yeah. <laughs> Replace it with abominable looking. <laughs> so I guess we're. I think as a clown college, we just make sure on this episode we let everybody know on Mike Sales episode. 
that were pledging for Trump 2024. Yeah. No, 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 <laughs> yeah. no, 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 yep. no, no, no. Brandon believes it. No, he told me off camera. He did. Yeah. It was it. Now Hulk Hogan was cool as shit. When he, <laughs> look at this, man. When he pulled up and ripped this shit off, it made me think of 1984. But when, nah, man, not today. I'm That's still not year. voting for him. Cause man, he got that flying, flying. What is that thing called? The flying knee. Mm-hmm. Perfect. And then Donald Trump, he can't lose. You make him lose, he's gonna fire you. Okay. I what? believe. Uh, See, I don't. <laughs> on, on paper, Brandon is the biggest Republican. Oh, yeah. No, yeah. Uh, Jim Brewer. Uh, Jim Brewer is his favorite comic. What was the other thing, dude? What uh, was it? Hulk Hogan. Hulk nah, Hogan. Man. At the uh, RNC. Yeah. yeah. That's wrestling, you know, just wrestling. But that's that's two people who are hardcore Trumpers, Damn, and you, you love them. Jim Brewer was. <laughs> See, that's why, that's why I know you didn't know one of his jokes. Damn, but man. I've never seen Brandon laugh harder. And the dude. giggle on you, it was worth everything that we yeah. were there. Just. He what's your he was like, ah! Brandon's just like ah! his expression man was it was just, just a way to do move yeah yeah like yeah he was possessed it's funny dude man by something crazy by the funny bone exactly by the funny bone demon mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> crazy <laughs> oh shit where we at. What what time we at? Twenty four minutes. Oh yeah, let's. Uh, oh, we have to cut we seventeen cut. of those yeah. minutes. We, we got cut by four minutes. Now, so that's right on time. All right, we got Mike Sales coming up. <laughs> Mr. Sales. Mr. Dude. Sales himself, the yeah, most famous dude. person in Huntsville. Presidential barber. Presidential barber. Bang bang gang gang. Cut cut. Wait, he can't be the most famous person in Huntsville, dude. Matthew Lumber lives here. That is true. Oh yeah. That is true. <laughs> Team pop Hell sensation. Yeah. Team yeah. pop. Hell yeah. I said Team Pop Sensation bringing Lumbra up. He and hates every, it. And everybody in the crowd went, mm. Damn. <laughs> but that's what happens every time. Yeah. That's why I love it so much. He hates it with his whole heart. <laughs> and it brings me joy that yeah. I just can't describe in words, man. It's a good man. Right there, man. I love that he hates it. Oh, Lumbra. We're also, me, Lumbra, and uh, we need, I don't know who our next team, who our other teammate was. Oh, me, me Lumbra, and Blake. Russell. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Versus you. I don't know who you guys' other teammate is. Me, Brandon, and somebody to be determined. Uh-huh. Yeah. We'll find somebody. Scott Easton here. said he'll play. He can hmm. be on our team. I swear yeah. he said he'll play. He I'm said he scared. can beat me, too, which I think I, I don't think he can. I'm just scared he might hit Brandon out of anger. Oh, that is possible. Oh, yeah. for sure. You will get yelled at, without a doubt. That's when you got to come back and be like, well, I don't know. You're the best. If Brandon's the best. Defense, just defense. And inside And shots. layups. And layups. Yes. You say you're best at defense, decent defense, defense and layups when you got two other teammates is perfect. You know okay. what they call Hell Brandon yeah. on the court, dude? What's that? The spider. Because it's like he's got eight arms. Hey. Blocking all your shots, yep. dude. Yeah, them blocks, man. Locked down. Hell to the yeah. Brick Hell house, yeah. right? That's what they play. It's a brick da, 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 house when I'm out there, man. <laughs> <laughs> brick, brick house is not what you want to be in basketball. Okay, hold on. Not <laughs> with the shots. I'm talking about <laughs> defense. Defense. But the, the shots, they're like, he's not a brick house, man. They call they, they call the him layups. the wall because he supports Trump and he stops oh, everybody no, from being no, passing. No, 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 no. I no. like this new angle. Brandon no, is a, Brandon is a no. Trump supporter. No. We'll, get no, we'll, we'll get you a MAGA hat. No, we will get. We absolutely will get you a MAGA hat. Bright I'm red. Good. Yep. I'm good. And if not, Alex will Photoshop you into one. Damn. Yep. And we'll have that Damn. imagery mm-hmm. ready to go. Damn. Well, they, make they it, make it a too small hat too. Brandon, Brandon, let. Let's end on this, all okay. right? Brandon, please give a message to the people watching the podcast at home. How should, give them some advice for this these uncertain times, these this election times. coming yes. up. Joe Biden just dropped out. Trump's running. We don't know who the other guy man, or man. the man. other guy is going to be. <laughs> well, they got the best chance, Hillary Clinton. I'm saying it. I mean, you just sit back, relax, and smoke some weed if you do that. You just sit through it. And that's all we can do because uh, I don't I don't know who to tell you to pick because I don't know anything about this mm-hmm. except that Trump and Biden now Biden's gone so we just got Trump here so I don't know mm-hmm. I don't know none of this now I ev- need to do some research and figure it out words to live by yes by Brandon Willis just that wasn't just very relax. comforting but I, <laughs> <laughs> just but relax I like- it's all right <laughs> I'll pat you on the shoulder. This week's featured comedian. Shouts out to all the studs that's throwing every possible dick tonight. Hell yeah, lots of voices.
like I support my friends. I got a dyke, stud, gangsta ass friend. She was Tupac of studs. Yeah, yeah. She called her back. She said, listen, she, I got a situation going on. You know, I, I broke up with Ella. Yeah, she fucking a Thunderbird. That's somebody a little older than the cool. I said, God damn it. <laughs> fucking a Thunderbird. Whatever. I said, what's going on? She said, listen, you know how much trouble I be in. I left my strap over to her crib. Could you go get it for me? <laughs> I said, strap. I said, okay. Because I know she be shooting at niggas and shit all the time. <laughs> so I get my mind again. I said, I'm going to pick it up. Because that's my friend. I trust her. I want to be safe. I want to pick up the strap. It wasn't a fucking strap I thought she was talking about. <laughs> It was a fucking white dick. I was like, fuck you black, what you doing with white dick? <laughs> oh yeah, I was pissed. Like I said, she got me with a white dick. I picked it up. I was embarrassed as fuck with a girl like, yeah, she threw it at me. I had to kill this shit. <laughs> so I get in the car and shit, I ride off. I said, I'm not taking this fucking dick to her in the condition that it was in when she gave it to me. I'm throwing this bitch in the street real quick. I did. <laughs> Go was drive, bitch. I threw it in the street. Car, <laughs> cars trampling over, running over this shit. Dude, I'm just sitting there watching this shit. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 Took a picture of it. Dip it. Sent it to her. Crazy <laughs> shit. Yeah. But I sent it to her. I said, listen, don't you ever in your life tell me to come pick up a strap for you. <laughs> Bitch, I do this shit. And I started to use a strap because I was like, fuck it. I ran out of my agri pills. See, I'm 54, so my dick don't work all the time. <laughs> but when it does, I'm pounding. <laughs> Hell yeah. But anyway, I fucked around and got the strap. Took it to him. Right. Balls and shit. You ain't got to stop talking, Mike. Yeah, oh, yeah. shit. I'm just, uh, yeah. I'm just focused like a motherfucker. Right, hey, don't be. Don't be. Just like, hey, it's just us talking. We chilling. I appreciate that, chilling bro. Chilling villains. I feel like I got to put this goddamn chapstick on. <laughs> Dude, that shit have brought my eyes yeah, also, yeah, man. <laughs> Those glasses look like you can see in 4D, man. <laughs> Hell yeah. I can, for real. <laughs> put chapstick on because after that meal, don't cook. That didn't make you lick your lips about five or six times a, a bite. Uh, <laughs> she was good. Yeah, 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 yeah. You need what you need Publix for. Exactly. Make it. Well, you, you just buy all the ingredients separately and then make it and take them home. Yeah, yeah. I'll show you how to make it too. What? <coughs> the deli stuff. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. Man. He, 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 call, he coughing a lot. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know what's happening. When everybody's in the living room and they're sitting down, that's all I heard. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that all left to the right of it behind me. <laughs> Audio listeners. Hold up, I heard this, yeah. too, heard this shit too. Listen. Oh wow, damn. <laughs> Niggas drinking and shit. Water. <laughs> AMS water. water. <laughs> I like this ASMR. I know that's what yeah, I was yeah. saying. I like, that's a good one. <laughs> Mountain Dew and shit. <laughs> yeah, all type Mountain Dew type shit. Mother no burping and shit. Getting their mind right in their body. <laughs> that honey hot sauce was good. I man. told you, dog. Oh, that, that, hot honey. that hot honey, dog. But it's on the rise to, right now. For, hey. for whites, we have to do one part hot honey, three parts mayonnaise to <laughs> hey, balance I'm, it out. Dude. I'm going to tell you how you know you got a good meal. After you finish, you do this shit. <laughs> That's what I did. Hey, hey, JJ. Yeah, yeah, what's going on? Who we got on the pod today, man? Dude, today we have a fucking entrepreneur. Oh, number one. Dude. He's fucking famous. Barber. Most famous in Huntsville. Non-surgical <clears throat> hair transplants Ooh. and remedies. And yep, yep. a hell of a good comedian. <clears throat> hell yeah. Super cool guy. Today we have 10 Stacks, a.k.a. Mike Sayers. Hey! hey. What up, what up? Thanks for coming Gosh. on, Big Mike. Hell yeah, I appreciate y'all, man. I finally got in this bitch. This bitch is hard. It's like trying to get in the White House. This shit <laughs> And hey, you here, baby. Yeah, yeah, you are, and you wore all white. Look, you met, you showing us up, man. Man, Hell listen, yeah. I said, man, first impression. You never get a second chance to make a first impression. You, you never? Yeah, no. So I said, I'm going all the way out in this bitch. <laughs> yeah, you beat up Hell Michael yeah. Buble and stole his suit. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. So, yeah, I, I just, I just, that's how I think. I said, I got to, it's like a job interview to me. Hey. 
This ain't no job. We chilling, nah, dog. Yeah, y'all, y'all be, chilling. You know what Grab I'm saying? Happy dad. <laughs> death row. Look, it's death row. Hell yeah. yeah. And they mean by that, you know what I'm saying? Y'all, 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 <laughs> y'all yeah, some hood man. niggas, educated niggas at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, that's how. It, that's exactly how I describe myself. <laughs> <laughs> but so I yeah, said, just like that. I said it with flavor though, because y'all have flavor too. You got, you know, Alex. You got JJ. You got Brandon. Yourself. Gentlemen, right here, man. Y'all, <laughs> <laughs> Jack. Jack, that's our intel Jack, guy. Jack. He got all, he got all the good shit on you, man. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, man. I you know appreciate that. That's that's good, man. I appreciate that. We got you. See, uh, I like that you're uh, you go out there and do it. So I heard this. Tell me if it's true. I think JJ told me. Well, uh, your first time doing stand up, you hosted a mic. My first time doing stand up, I did host a mic. That's yeah. insane. Rocket Republic. Yep, I did. Yeah. That was a good and, mic. And I'm a, I remember that. I'm gonna tell you some what I here's here's my perception on things. You know, I've been an entrepreneur. <laughs> I've been an entrepreneur ever since I was like 17 years old. Uh-huh. I quit school, bro, like in 11th grade, because I was so fucking uh, ahead of my my time. When I say ahead of my time, I had a job as a barber. I was making more than my mom and dad while I was in high school, mm. and that shit just took me on a whole nother level, man. And I, I fucked around, and flunked out of school. But I got my GED. I went back and got my Let's go. Yeah. Hell Let's yeah. go. Where yeah. we at, Brandon? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, put that shit on there. That's what's up. That's what I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. It mean I get to eat double. Yeah, yeah. That bitch was hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so uh, from there I said, in order for me to make it, I got to go out there and make it myself. Because being in a barbershop, I network with people. But I, in the black community, you don't know a lot of people that's doing, you know, the level of thinking that I am on. I say I am on like. No, you for real. Uh, yeah, that's girl. that's real. Because yeah. everybody works somewhere. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I used to tell people my dreams. Like, man, you crazy, bro. Next thing you know, I'm doing it. And they say, damn, you did it. Hey, doing mm-hmm. it doing it hard. Uh, I, I work with somebody, right? He just got hired. And uh, we was talking about when I was about when I asked you to come on. He was like, you know Mike Sales? I was like, you know who he is? He said, yeah, everybody know Mike Sales. <laughs> <laughs> you must be a goddamn legend, boy. Oh man, born and raised here, man. Born and raised. Hell yeah. How long? How long you had the uh, shop, Mike's Presidential? Uh, I'm gonna tell you the, the way I came up with Mike and Bill's Presidential was in 19. Was it 90? Was it okay? September 1994. No, 1994 is when I, I started cutting. Yeah, it was 1994. Yep. Oh shit. That I came up with Mike. It was Mike and Bill's Barbershop then. My dad. I worked for the guy, this guy named Anderson Carroll. We used to call him Cat. Uh-huh. Anyway, Cat was one of the barbers that trained a lot of young barbers during my time, you know, in the haircutting business. And it's about seven to eight barbers that worked with him. And we worked with Cat for about 12 years. And uh, I stayed with Cat. Cat ultimately passed away. When he passed away, we, we were all working for him. And my uh, dad stepped in and took over the shop for us. He said, y'all can continue working. I'll talk to the landlord. And I keep y'all guys working. So we stayed working. And it was me and my dad's shop. He gave me an opportunity to, you know, learn how to be an entrepreneur. He had a restaurant mm-hmm. that was next door to the barbershop. Oh, okay. And I had the barbershop, so we stayed pumping, man. Hey. We, was, we was doing it. Since 94, still going. Hell, Hell yeah. Hell 30 yeah. 30 years. 30 years now. 30 years. Now, looking Long at Mike, you, you probably didn't know he was that old. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you, you look, you're young, but you look like a young boy. You got buck. that youthful glow, man. Hell I, yeah. I appreciate it, man. 54. Uh, 54, dog. Uh, hey, yeah. 54. Hey, look good, man. And you, still, and you still be like, hey, we had a night uh, the other night, didn't we? Man, I was so fucked up the next day. <laughs> my language. I was tired. I, I probably got two hours of sleep and had to go cut some heads. I don't know how you did it. When you yeah. told me you had to be up at five thirty, I knew you was looking. <laughs> I was looking back. I was like, you was looking like, get these motherfuckers up out of my house. Man, <laughs> the next day at work, everybody got the business. Damn. If you know, when I say get got the business, you know, I had clients be joking around with me. Oh, mm-hmm. nigga, I was ready to fight that. Ass. <laughs> Damn, because I was tired. Little buzz, you know what I'm saying? Niggas almost tore my house up and shit. Hey, who who was that? <laughs> that dude, Lizard. What's that, Liz? Uh, Uncle what's Lizard. Lizard. Uncle Lizard. Uncle Lizard. Man, that nigga was turning flips and shit in the house. <laughs> he swear to God, though. Jumped off the fucking couch and... <laughs> he called him Lizard. Land on the floor. <laughs> pictures fell off the wall and shit. Yeah, dude, I'm really sorry my dad did that. <laughs> Look at him. That's shit, that Uncle uh, Lizard right there. Fucking... They go a better one. Uh, <laughs> Dante was going live and shit on, in there, man. She was crazy. We Dante know did 30 minutes. 
Oh, 30 dude. minutes. At least. Like more than <laughs> on, the, on the mic. Yeah. Probably 40. Yeah, yeah, that shit was crazy. He had them, he had them rolling, bro. Brandon was trying to get him up Man. off there. He was like, let me tell y'all a story. Dante just kept on coming oh in. Like, ah, how about this? Yeah. <laughs> Dante makes money on TikTok Live, though. For real? Yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, shit. Oh, that's good. He be having people on there? Because they show all making fun of him. He had like 400 people on there the other day. For real? Really? Concurrent yeah. live viewers, yeah. Oh, Damn. That's, that's dope. I Man, I looked in the kitchen doing that night, man. I seen Alex and fucking Brandon doing a robot or some shit. They was on the what the fuck. <laughs> Damn. Them motherfuckers moving. Like, uh, I mean, that's. Yeah, I was having uh, a good night. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. So after. Uh, <laughs> Brandon left some encyclopedias and shit in my house. What the fuck? Uh, is she was over there? <laughs> Brandon. Oh. <laughs> some Britannic encyclopedias and shit. Oh, yeah. What which, the fuck? Which did you... letter? <laughs> huh? Which letter you leave over there, man? What letter did I leave? Yeah. Letter? Like, are you talking about like specific letter? What are you talking about? Like the mail-in like letter? Letters. Or the alphabet letter? Like an alphabet going? letter. Okay. Yeah, what, the alph- what alphabetical order. <laughs> yeah, so, which one? Which one? I guess I guess B. B. That's the one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. B is good. B, B and smooth, then you yeah. got J and then you got W. Yeah, BJW. <laughs> <laughs> ah, hey, that's better. I wish I had that. BJW. That's a better. I was just talking shit, man. I had fun though. It was, it was, it was cool. Hell yeah, it was fun. It was so crazy because like we went to Incredible, then they had the stand up live, and Laser did both of those shows. And then uh, Jake calls me. I'm passing out flyers for Epic with Scott. Right. Jake calls me. He's like, "Come to Mike's house and Uncle Laser and everybody over here." And you have the whole Birmingham crew. All of us. I mean, it was it was a good time. Man, we, no, we, we chilled for a minute till 2 o'clock at your house. Hell yeah. Man, I, I was wanting you to kill my fucking neighbor. He was roasting. I wanted to jump in so bad. No, nah, I ain't roast? Oh, hell yeah. He was roasting dumb. I wrong <laughs> dumb. Damn, I was man. like, God damn, I want to get him. <laughs> Shit. He, uh, he was just, he, it, first of all, he was just saying like, uh, all you had to do is say shit. Say shit. You know, just say shit that don't, <laughs> ma- don't, don't make no sense. <laughs> yeah, you was like, man, I ain't ready for this shit, bro. We about to go. <laughs> Hell yeah. But Mike, you remember that person that was swinging until the morning time? Hell man? yeah. Wouldn't she, stop? She, swinging till, she swung on until like 11 o'clock. Damn. That's meth. I believe she can pay for this shit. She might have a TikTok. She might be, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> man. Uh, that was crazy. <laughs> that shit was crazy. Man. Dead Children's Playground. <laughs> That's the Dead Children's Playground over there? Shit, swings be moving and shit by oh themselves. My God. For real? Yeah, yeah. Because I've heard about ghost. it. It's a Huntsville thing. Yeah. I didn't know it was over there by your shop, though. No, nah, that's, oh, no, that's, no. that's the black Dead Children's Playground. Uh, <laughs> the real one's near five points. Like, I've, I've seen it. I the white one in white five points. It's <laughs> normal. That's in the middle of a grave graveyard and shit. Yeah. This one in the hood. I'll take you. <laughs> if you want to go see it, we'll no, go together. That's fine. You scared of that shit? Yeah. You dude. scared of haunted shit? Me? Mm-hmm. Man, I seen the ghost when I was young, bro. You it's seen crazy. the ghost? Hell yeah, it was my Who? uncle. Te- oh, tell me about shit. it. Man, my uncle had passed away. It's hard. We were in the country. We lived so far in the country. Damn, my, let me tell my. We was in the country. My auntie and my uncle, they live like where no fucking lights at, street lights or nothing. So all you saw was moonlight. I was in the back room sleep. And fuck, I looked in the window, man. I woke up and just looked in the window. I swear to God, I seen this nigga looking at me. He was standing right there just looking. I went right back under the covers. I said, shit. You know, the covers save you when you see a ghost. And shit. <laughs> really? they did. That's true, dude. That's yeah, true. yeah. There's some type of force field that's around blankets and, <laughs> yeah. and, and sheets. Yeah, he did helped you, me. Did you, ever pick, did you ever peek back up and see if he was still Yeah, there? no. I stayed up under that bitch. I was not looking back out of there. <laughs> It was the moonlight too and shit. I, I said, "Hell no!" Nah. I went Man. to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Did you wake up under the cover still, or was it gone? Like, was I just woke up, up like normal, you no know, normal morning. Like shit, I just seen my uncle last night. <laughs> shit. Yeah. His name was Uncle Henry, by the way. Uncle Henry, yeah. Shout yeah. Out. Henry Rest was cool as hell, man. He used to always talk to us, let me ride on his tractor and shit. Oh, yeah, that yeah. was country, cool country. Yeah, he owned a lot of land. Uh. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. In fact, they still own the land. That land that my uh, my uncle owned, they still have it. Oh, that's what's up, man. Yeah. That shit worth good money now. Yeah. In Madison, off Zert Road. Oh shit! Oh, damn. Yeah, that's right here. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I mean, right. I don't, that's down down the way is right where Williams Elementary School is. Mm-hmm. Right in the curve. Yeah, no shit. That's my family's land. Yeah. Hell yeah. It's for sale yeah. too. <laughs> <laughs> Promote it. Tell them where they can buy this shit at. They want one point, uh, my aunt. Uh, Want one point five million for that land? Ooh, yeah, I mean that's that. what I'm, I don't I mean that's that's high, but it's yeah. a good space. It's ten acres, and then oh, she yeah, owns yeah. thirty more. You know, on beside that, she's keeping that land though. Oh yeah, she Damn, can get that dude. for ten acres in yeah. Madison. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. 
Well, Hunts- something around there. Yeah, Huntsville Madison. Fucking- yeah, they'll build a car wash over there or something, <laughs> dude. <laughs> I mean, something. Build something yeah. nice, it, man. Because uh, most houses are only on like 0.35 acres around That's here. That's crazy. And so just think how many houses you yeah, can Not right even there. that. Even smaller than that. Just lots. Uh-huh. You know, like, well, I would say 100 by 75 feet lot. You know what I'm saying? 100 in width. 75 and length. I mean, not even that. My, I mean, a small lot will yeah. cost you some real, like, oh, yeah, yeah. And in Madison, it will. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. That's you go in the right neighborhood. Mm hmm. Well, yeah. However, you know, so good Brent, credit. Brandon got, had a question for him. Oh, yeah. So, uh, you remember you told me back in the day you used to do, like, what was it, break dancing back in the 80s? Yeah, man? yeah. Hell yeah, man. Yeah, I got a video. I was, I was I'm doing some dancing and shit. <laughs> it's on YouTube. Go, go to YouTube. Oh, damn. Hold on. What's it called? I just type in 10 S T A C K S S. Whoa, hold on. One ten more stack. Time? Ten stack. Oh, ten stack. <laughs> You're going to trip Brandon up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the letters. He only I used he to, couldn't I, handle one earlier. I used to be in a group called North Alabama Breaking Crew. Get damn. the fuck out of yeah. here. Yeah, I used to break this. Ten stack. You got to go to YouTube, man. Yeah, YouTube. It was back in the 80s. We, uh, we used to dance in. Different um, venues and shit. They used to call us in. Chrysler, the corporation, had us come in one time and do a damn um, a oh, dance session at um, what is it? Uh-huh. Indicator, that big water park. What is it? Point Mallory. Point, Point Mallory. Yeah, they had a big. Damn. Yeah, we did a little break breakout session. Hair around up. the cardboard Nigga, I spin, and shit. I used to spin on my head and shit. Windmill. Damn. For real? Hold my nuts. And, and you got a good one to spin on. You don't want to show on that. Then. My head. Yeah, 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 yeah I show my head. Come on, let them know. Let them know we got. Huh. Bam! Hell, Hell yeah. yeah. Got you. <laughs> Hell yeah. I touched up. I, that boy I searched smooth. it up. I Did you go to 10 stacks? Yeah, I searched up 10 it's stacks. It's 2S. 2S oh, at the 2S end. 2S at the end. Yeah. All right, hold on. But yeah, and in fact, guess my mama was our, was our manager. Hold on. My mom. Oh, shit. Yeah. Let me go down. So y'all, uh, so they, damn, they contract you out go to uh, Go to the shorts. All right. Hold on. Let me stop that. The uh, shorts. Boy. Okay, let me that see. That boy Mike. Right here, the, the third video at the top. Right here? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> oh, let me turn it up. Oh, shit. <laughs> what? Got a pooping <laughs> shit on that question? <laughs> <laughs> Will you have beef in the 80s? <laughs> Push it down. Push it up. Oh, oh. Hey. Hey. Uh, uh, oh shit! Uh, uh, hold on, check it out. <laughs> you got it all out the camera. <laughs> <laughs> that's that, that's how you know Mike. Oh, he on the Shit, that's what you, we had. That's the hand work right okay, there. Okay, okay. Yeah. Chrysler uh, paid you to do this in a water park. <laughs> Hell yeah, they paid. That's they, crazy. Yeah. They like this shit. This shit was just Hell like. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> what year was that? This is nineteen eighty-five. 1980. Oh, damn, that's that before I was born. Yeah, 1985. Uh, 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 calm down, Jack. It was damn. before I was born. Huh? Hey, go to this one right here, this bottom with the, blue, the guy with the blue shirt, the little right boy. Yeah. <laughs> he just left for barbershop. It was my homeboy. I'm giving the barbershop a promotion. That was his yeah. dude fucked his head up. Oh. Damn. Oh, damn. <laughs> I was just running some funny shit, huh? But, yeah. I, I, I've been on YouTube, too, since you... 2009, so I got a damn a following. I got over uh, one of my videos got over 1.9 million views. Damn, cool. Yeah, that's awesome, dude. Hey, cause you hey, you be hey, you change people's lives with this shit. Yeah, man, now, I, it's it's what I love to do. Mike, I went to school with your son, Anthony. Yeah, and th- this this is something I distinctly remember. Correct me if I'm wrong. Did y'all not have a reality show about y'all's lives? We we didn't, but we I was always online doing some crazy stuff with, with my family, with my kids. In fact, this uh, video of me and Anthony right here, the second row, so, fourth video. That's eight. That's right, right So there. why uh so yeah why do you rem- remember that? Because Anthony was telling me about it. Really? Yeah, he was telling me about it. I thought it was a reality show. It was filmed like a reality show, wasn't yeah, it? it? It was sort of like that. It was just me and my phone, man. I just really. Uh, Caught hold to being on fire online, and I just was kind of like documenting parts and portions of our, 
no family time. Uh huh. So it was a reality show. Yeah, it it's was. probably the realest yeah, yeah. reality yeah. reality show. Yeah, like this right here where, where he's edging up. I'm right edging him up at. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was actually getting ready to do a. Uh, he's an actor too. He was getting ready to do a. Um, he was going to do a. Uh, what is it when the filmmakers want you to come? Oh, audition. Audition. audition yeah, mm -hmm. he was going to an audition. Yeah, right there. He's he's a, a very he's a good actor. Hell yeah. Okay, my where son, he he live here still? Yeah, he lives here. My son weird as shit though. <laughs> I saw him dressed up like Spider Man. Oh yeah, I remember you told yeah. me about that, Miles yeah. Morales. Oh, he kind of looked like he could pull yeah. off Miles Morales. I call his ass Miles per hour. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Love me to death though. Why you say he's weird, man? Yeah. See, he just you know he like he's like his mama. His mama they weird, you know, just strange, you know. He, <laughs> Wow. Different people. I love both of them, but they're weird. I'm, I'm fucking weird too. Me too, man. No, you might. I'm weird a little bit. Like I'm gonna tell you, when I say weird, I'm talking about like you'll be talking to him. He act like he don't understand nothing you're saying. He just ignoring you. Like I don't want to talk to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just weird. Just strange. You know. That might just be with you. Mike. You got some funny acting. Y'all got funny acting people in your family? Though? Oh hell, oh, oh yeah. god, yeah. <laughs> Shit, drug addicts. Oh, That's what I'm saying. Funny acting people. Oh, Everybody yeah. got them. He, he's one of them. I didn't know. I, I think I'm one too. <laughs> you say you say you are. Hell yeah, I'll be funny acting. Well, you Especially, gotta be like that to be a comedian, man. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. Guess you gotta get prepared for the future, right? Oh yeah. Look, being a comedian is something. Is going up there and standing in the pocket when shit ain't going well. Oh yeah. Might, you do that shit like nobody else. Man, I'm the, <laughs> I'm the best at it. Dog. Hell yeah. You do it. I sit up there and be like, shit, this nigga, did he really just say that? <laughs> he should say this. He ain't saying that. I'm sorry to use the nigga word all the time. Man, you crazy, though, know what you're working with? Yeah. What the fuck you talking about? Yeah. yeah. The new niggas, it, white folks. <laughs> <laughs> we only got one white. He's Filipino. Yeah, I ain't lying. You Filipino? Filipino. Uh, Get the hell out of here. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, I'm telling you, there's a smorgasbord in this bitch right now. <laughs> hell yeah. What's a smorgasbord? <laughs> it's like charcuterie, but oh, charcuterie. races. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know what, you know what no Brandon? I swear to God, I don't know what a smorgasbord is either. I just Smorgage. a lot. I just know Smorgage. it's what a lot, a a lot. Yeah. Right, okay. See. I don't know yeah, if we should yeah. be going to dumb. We're to see what it looks like. It's not, it's not a lot. I mean, that's literally what it means. I fuck with that. I, is it something to do with marshmallows and shit? Smorgasbord? <laughs> oh, no, this is it right here. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Yes, dude, it is marshmallows in there. Uh, no! Oh, that's a charcuterie board. Man, look at that. You got no, the whole he looked smorgasbord. Oh, board. Board. <laughs> that says <laughs> s'mores board. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, he got it but, right, but look, it's a hey, smorgas chocolate. <laughs> uh, smorgas chocolate. Yeah, because you think about when you think about s'more, you know, smorgas. Uh -huh. You ever go to? A, <laughs> he's breaking it down to the Latin you know, root. Yeah. Yeah. Whenever we go to the campfire and you have fucking marshmallows on the stick, what is it called? S'more. S'more. There it is. S'more. Yeah, but that's not. It's the same smorgas. family, right? No. You know? No. No. Big guys would know anything about food <laughs> and shit. <laughs> I'm guessing this is like a dessert. <laughs> Shit, he know about the marshmallows. Brandon, you just clicked on the one that says s'mores charcuterie board. All right, hold on. Let's find a more gross Brandon one. Brandon finna go find no, this. No, go to all and okay. just look at what it means. All right, let's see. A buffet offering a variety of hot and cold meals, solid hors d'oeuvres, etc. Hors d'oeuvres? Hors d'oeuvres. <laughs> yeah, man, so it's a buffet sweetened style. You uh -huh. know what I mean? Oh, that, well, yeah. you did say a lot of stuff. Bad. It's a lot. Yeah. It could uh -huh. be anything. You got bread, butter, board. cheese, s'mores, mm -hmm. marshmallows. Smorgasbord. Mm -hmm. It could be anything. You like cheese or, uh, you like cheese? Would you rather have a cheese platter or a meat platter? Hold on, cheese platter or a vegetable platter? Oh, man, that's easy. Well, I like vegetable platters because I like the, the sauces and the uh -huh. dressings that I can dip my stuff in. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. Yeah. I like that. Broccoli. Like what you had back in there, the the, uh, the cheese dip. What is it called? Rotel. Rotel. That rotel, yeah. man. You put your damn yeah. foot in that rotel, bro. <laughs> that shit did. That, bro. that wasn't. That's me. a that was Velveeta public, cheese buddy. rotel. <laughs> public. Nah, That's that doggone food stamp cheese ro uh, rotel. Yeah. <laughs> Government cheese. <laughs> Government cheese. Yeah. That block that of cheese. Good. Yeah. It's just a block of cheese. Yeah. Like, uh, oh, some type of cheese. I think it was American. What is America? It yeah, better you, be, dude. Dom, <laughs> Dom, you can cook. <laughs> I tried, man. I'm glad oh, yeah. you liked it. Oh, you do, do a good job. Mike, what do you think about Biden dropping out of the election, mm -hmm. man? Man, I, you know what? I just, I just, I look at it like this. This shit was the best 
Steven Spielberg playbook I ever seen. I agree. This shit was Hollywood, man. We just yep. seen fucking Hollywood on real in real life. 4K, that, like my daughter say. Yeah, actually, that's yeah. right. Yeah, I mean, after Trump, you know, Trump got, after he got shot at yep. when you see when all of them was hugging each other. Yeah. yeah. I expect them niggas to do this. Like they do in the basketball game and shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Throwing the arms up and shit. Like, oh, shit, we did it. We did it. Hell yeah, Trump was so excited. I ain't never seen somebody excited to get shot because he already knew it's, it's on. Mm. Oh, yeah, once he didn't die, he knew. He was this like, shit it's is mine. jumping. It's popping. I'm back. Yeah. And I'm about to acquit myself of all these felonies I have. Yeah, so. Yeah. so you better believe so, that. So I, it just gave us the idea of what guys need to do. If you ever get in some trouble, get you don't know how to get out of it. Know what to do. <laughs> I might need to take that. Grab advice. your damn beer. Oh shit. Get shot in the air. Nah, like ain't, it ain't gonna help no niggas. They going to jail. <laughs> yeah. Damn, man. With, I'm with eliminated. A, with, with a busted up head. All right, here, yeah, well. <laughs> now don't try this shit at home because right. it ain't gonna work out the same. Yeah, you're right. Do you think you could shoot my ear off without killing me? Yeah, I think maybe. I would trust you. Maybe. That, that, I, I don't think that's a very good <laughs> Maybe. Answer, yeah, yeah, speaking uh, of the ears, man, this dude was talking to me the other day. He's going to tell me, let me tell you something. And he whispered my ears. Uh, Who did that? Who? I said, hold up, bro. You making me hot and shit. I'm getting. Brandon I did that? Brandon. Brandon. I didn't say what? Brandon. I said a dude. Oh. oh. oh I was like, damn. I thought you said Mom. my Brandon. Anybody ever did this shit want to tell you something in the ear and they get too close to your ear and be touching your ear? No, your no. Hey, I'm no. I won't allow that. See, that's some old school shit. That shit that. Guys used to do. They be whispering for real. Yeah, don't don't. You ever talk to a whisperer though? Yeah, right yeah. Here. I talk to people who talk like Jake Monksy. but uh, <laughs> I'm talking about real you. talk. Have anybody ever whispered something to you? Yes. Yeah. All the time. They, they ain't get by your ears. Yes. I mean, maybe when I was younger. Since I've been a grown man, See, I don't like people touching my face. Like, nah, no, you ain't. This doing all that. you hear? Look. Like God. Nah, that's not gonna happen. That shit is nasty, man. What the fuck? <laughs> when my grandma used to whisper to me at church, she would say it loud enough so everybody on the pew could hear it. You know, she would act like she was whispering, like she's dressed like a whore. Yeah, and, 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 and everybody hears it. Yeah, and there's a reason why I said that. It's because I was just, you know, just thinking about Donald Trump's ear. You know, mm -hmm. <laughs> he got a big. Ain't nobody whispering to him. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't gonna have no whisper. He might, you know, the other side got to be used to hear everything else. You know what I'm saying? But he about to be the president. I like Trump, man. You like Trump? <laughs> Hell, y'all like him, man. Mm -hmm. And the, I'm gonna tell you why I like him. This is a Trump 2024 podcast. No, right? no, I don't. No, I'm gonna tell you why I like him. Cause you got you got a, a guy that's running for president that is aggressive. Mm -hmm. He got one that's passive, right? Yeah. I really the aggressive motherfucker to win. Well, you know, aggressive can't be bad for the leader of the free world. It can, it can go, it yeah. Can go, it can go a little awry, but I mean, it could go. All right I mean, I'm, I'm just, I, I'm not a person that's for a Republican or a Democrat. I, I'm going like, like everybody like LeBron. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like my team player Trump. <laughs> Wait, you gonna follow him everywhere? So you yeah. remember this last night, the other day, when, when Hulk Hogan was on there and he ripped that shirt? Yeah, yeah, he ripped that shirt off and he had uh, Trump 2024. Yeah. How'd you feel about he that? He couldn't even man. get the bottom piece broke. He, <laughs> he struggled with this shit. Man, he's old. He took me back to 84, though, man. Those are the days. Yeah. <laughs> and I ain't gonna lie, man. <laughs> he wasn't alive in the slightest. <laughs> but I, you know, I ain't gonna lie. Working at the barbershop, it's hard to make it to the polls, though. I'm talking all this shit and I might not vote. You be voting? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You I vote do. for Obama twice? I voted for him one time. I told mm -hmm. you I might not. Some, I didn't make it to the polls the second time. Uh -huh. D D that's how he lost. No, he, he ran all eight years. No, nah, yeah, he won. Oh, yeah, he yeah, won beating Obama. He's too smooth. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, if only he'd come back, you know. Come back in Chicago, go back to shooting like they were. You know, shoot <laughs> oh, like a motherfucker in Chicago. <laughs> they ain't stop. Yeah, no, nah, he yeah, down the street. <laughs> He'll hide and shit. You got to. Yeah, yeah. Go out there. You got to be a crazed man. <laughs> you better know somebody. What the old block? Even then. Yo, you yeah. ever heard of old block? Yeah, oh, I heard yeah, of old dude. block. That's our. Now, it's in our intro. Well, yeah, it well, is in our intro. <laughs> is it? Yeah. yeah. Start oh, the footage. building. The top Throne of the building. building. Yeah, that's old block. Yeah. Oh fuck! Yeah. I ain't know that. I know why they call it old block because you only more. He's like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no. <laughs> Ultimate dad joke. Yeah, them motherfuckers crazy. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. But well, yeah. I think every every neighborhood has a bad community, even 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 the upper yeah. echelon, because you're running to a Karen. Oh yeah, she just the, it, the other flip side of the old block. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'd rather be shot, dude. Dude, white women get like uh, those kind of white women. They get them. so aggressive. Oh yeah, you know why they so be fast. mad and shit mm -hmm. though? You know why? Because they dated black guys and black guys and done the wrong and shit. 
I don't know about Karens. I don't think Karens are that are dating black guys. I think they did. You think they did? Yeah, hey, yo, that's why they pitched. The, who they get mad at all the time? Never a black woman. It's hard. It is. They but, know a black woman gonna beat that ass. But it'd be a black dude. Huh? Yeah, she mad as if he did her wrong. So she treating <laughs> every nigga she see bad in the fight. But that's good though. I love a Karen. You do? Yeah, I used to I, date, I, I date a chick that was like that. Yeah, that's what I know. <laughs> and one and one, she would always complain about shit. Like yeah, to, uh, well, no, she, nah, she was nice as shit. I ain't gonna lie, she was sweet. Well, ain't no care. You just but when I you broke up with her, she, when I tur- when I broke up with her, she turned to care. Oh, mm. Well, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm happened, talking about man. to everybody. <laughs> oh damn! And in, in one Ruined month, bro. Life, I, I don't know if y'all heard my comedy set, but in one month, bro, real talk, I went zip lining. I fucking went kayaking. Game night. Uh-huh. Game night. Hell, real talk. White and I, shit, dude. Yeah, and yep. I went cave That's diving. We went cave diving. You and cave diving. And saw a fucking waterfall. I would never do that, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did, man. Had a good time. You could swim? Yeah. No, yeah. I thought you could. Man, I took swim lessons (laughs) at Oakwood College, bro, when I was young. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, by a nigga named Eugene. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, shit. (laughs) (laughs) That nigga was Speedos and shit. He was teaching us with some panties and shit on. We didn't pay no attention to that shit. Brandon want to go now. Nah, man, not that. <laughs> Dude, I couldn't do the kayaking, man. Oh, I man, the kayaking. That's the, where you draw the line? That's where I draw the line. The cave But well, he can't swim. I mean, partially now. You saw I did the wave part. Yeah, but I'm Kayaking about is life. dangerous, though. I ain't gonna lie. Because I seen a Mexican got flipped over in the kayak. Mm. He was holding on to his book bag. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck he had in the book bag, but he was oh, not letting it go. They were just crossing up. And the white yeah, people were just looking at him. <laughs> White people just looking at me. They was going to let him drown. I had to get out my cat and go turn him back For over. For real? Yeah, they was looking at him, laughing and shit. I got out the water. <laughs> I ran over to my little, you know, hard bottom socks on and shit. I don't know what them socks called. They got the, the rubber. grippy socks? Yeah. Uh-huh. I ran over and turned them back over. He floated on down the river. I should have grabbed that book bag. I don't know what was in it. <laughs> Damn. Did he but live? He was, he was holding on to it. <laughs> huh? Did he live? Ass. Did he live? Yeah. Yeah, he floated on down the river. And then what's crazy thing about it, it was another Mexican behind him that flipped over too. I had to flip him back over. Damn. You yeah. would think they would be better in the water. Yeah, but shit. <laughs> Second generation. You know, yeah. you know, but it's ironic. A nigga helped him. Damn. That's, that's good, man. White folks on the sideline watching. It was it was such a it was an event. <laughs> yeah, real race. That's a shame. Real race wars. <laughs> race wars. <laughs> Who will win? And the Mexican was ahead because we was we was nah, <laughs> it was going. We was Mexicans flo- ain't winning the race. I'm telling I'm talking about oh, going yeah. on, on oh yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know who's gonna win that bitch. I tell you what I'm gonna be. Uh, smoking a blunt, looking out the window. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. I hear you. Yeah, uh, yeah, and then the ones that are fighting gonna be, you know. Y'all watch that movie? Mm-hmm. Well, um what's the name of the movie? It it was it was let me think of it. It was when the Tesla cars and shit start smashing into each other. Mm. Ah, it's the name of it. It's on Netflix. Tesla a new car. Movie? Are it you was, just talking about an electronic car? It, well, yeah. The, the, the premise of the movie is the our system went down. Mm-hmm. And the system went down. All the Tesla cars started driving by themselves and shit. But what I'm saying, that I said that to say this, is that I forgot what I was going to fucking do. <laughs> <laughs> I smoked too much. I forgot what I <laughs> Forgot what the fuck I was gonna say. Who, who's your favorite TV judge? Ooh. You ask me all the time who <laughs> my favorite judge is. I'm gonna tell you. Judge Joe Motherfucking Brown. Why <laughs> <laughs> you come to my courtroom smelling like weed? <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> He's I'm going to hold your contempt to court, and I'm going to call your mama. If she answers the phone, she's going to come get you, and I'm going to arrest her ass, too, because she holds the keys to your success, and she's not letting you live according to the way you're supposed to live, boy. He said, By the way, like pull it. your Damn. pants up while you're in the courtroom <laughs> and ask your daddy, do we have some weed? Because I'm ready to smoke me a dime bag. You know, back in the day, <laughs> yeah. back in the day they smoked dime bags. We ain't buy quarters yet. I'm just talking drugs because we, I'm weed game. <laughs> I ain't saying drugs. I don't do drugs. I smoke marijuana every now and then. I have to because I got ADHD, all this shit, because mm-hmm. it keeps me calm. Anybody yeah. have to do anything to keep you calm? Some people take a drink, wine. Yeah, I drink. Heroin. Me yeah, too. Yeah, heroin, yeah. Sometimes. Yeah, yeah some Not people. The I got a little bit left if you want something. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Man, I, I've been watching your boy. Y'all want to see your boy Joe, what was it, Goggins? 
David uh, Goggins. Goggins. That ain't man, not my it, boy. Just think if he was your boy. physical trainer. <laughs> 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 Um, I wouldn't need somebody like him. Though, you would though. die. Yeah, you would literally die. Yeah. Your leg broke. Get up. <laughs> Fuck that leg. Stop being a bitch. <laughs> yeah. Man, look at that comparison, man. He got it. Yeah, but he's fucking made of iron, bro. Oh, he great. Look at this picture. That says it right there. Whatever the fuck that fossil he holding, man. That's, well, a, that's a tree. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man. Shout out to David Dawkins. <laughs> thought it was a fossil. <laughs> Is this a that. beer? Yeah. Oh, man, I like that. see it say like death. Stay oh, hard. Look at it's, that. It's like a seltzer. So it's a Snoop Dogg's drink? I guess. Yeah, because Snoop, Snoop Dogg just... collaboration with the Nelk Boys. Yeah, because he bought Death Row. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. Try it out. Death Row, great. Let me try that drink. Crazy. Yeah. It's there for you, man. We ain't promoted by him or nothing. I don't know them niggas. I don't know them hey, I can't wait I y'all. I can't people. wait till y'all give me the chance to promote the podcast though. Oh yeah, yeah. That's what I was about to bring up. I'm waiting, man. Look, so uh we have our first what's it called? Sponsor. Sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> This fucking guy, man. <laughs> we got we got our first fucking sponsor here. Hell yeah, Mr. Mike Sales, Hell and yeah. Bill and uh, Mike and Bill's Presidential Barbershop. We're gonna shoot a commercial. It's gonna be hilarious. And uh, whenever you want to add up there, we'll throw it in. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I'm, mm-hmm. I'm ready because I and you we're know, gonna shoot a lot of footage, so it could be multiple from one shoot. We're gonna get multiple uh, multiple angles and yes, shit like that. Oh yeah, multiple ads. Okay, for sure. Because I oh oh damn. I got the bag of wigs out there, too. Oh, yeah. Hey, what episode is this? 37? 38? 38? 38? I don't know. Yeah. 38. <laughs> 38. It's 37, not 38. Yeah, whatever. Man, that's, man, congratulations to y'all, man. Oh, thanks, man. I want to that's, 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 You know, consistency counts, man. Y'all y'all been consistent. And I be messing y'all's name up, man. I always call y'all Clown Community College. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I say community, but it's Clown College. What happened outside of shenanigans? Oh, my God. Dude, Mike, you kill me with this, man. <laughs> you have always called it Clown Community College <laughs> since the beginning. And then the other day after the IQ test out of shenan- outside of shenanigans, we were standing there. And you said it again. And then you said, oh, I just made that up. <laughs> You've been saying that for a year, man. I damn sure have. It reminds me of Calhoun Community College. <laughs> It's a good college. Because a bunch of fools be going to community colleges. And community Dang. colleges are smart people, but some foolish niggas in there. No. <laughs> That's where niggas get their GED at and shit, the community college. Yeah, Hell yeah, dude. Yeah. When I used to take night class, I would see the GED class in there. Yeah, you, you could saw me tell. in a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Brandon, are you ever going to get your GED, man? I graduated. Uh, tell him. I, I graduated. I tell got my diplomacy already. Hey, y'all. Dang. Look shit. at this. It's on the board. Woo. He yeah. got his diplomacy, dude. Yeah. High school diplomacy, man. Now we're just trying to finish this college. We're struggling financially. We'll be back, though. Brandon yeah. got to stay in high school until he was 22. Dude. <laughs> Had a mustache. Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, man. I was driving to school in the fucking eighth grade. For real? Seven and eighth grade. My dad worked there. Yeah. Back in the 80s and shit, dad, uh-huh. daddies didn't give a damn. If they work third shift, nigga, they let the kids drive. <laughs> yeah. 30 keys and shit. I drove the biggest car to school. I drove a 1976 Thunderbird Cougar. Ooh, that <laughs> oh, Cougar yeah, Thunderbird. That Man, the mother was about, it was about as long as this damn, about six of these tables. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> and you drove that yeah, in eighth no, grade? No, it was a 79 Cougar. Oh, type 79 in, Cougar. Yeah, 1979 Cougar. Cougar Thunderbird. Mike, you actually told me, or you said on stage one time, what a Thunderbird is. I didn't know what a Thunderbird oh, yeah. was until you told me about it. What is it? Man. Oh, man. A Thunderbird is a lady Damn. just a little older than a cougar. That's oh, a yeah, 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 car, yeah. Man. What's that, the cougar that cutoff age? Cougar cutoff age is about 43. No. Really? No, that's way too that's still That's, that's the car page. right there. That's way too early. It was just like that, the blue one with the beige top. Uh-huh, that's I right. was in seventh grade driving a bitch to work. <laughs> You had to sit on some books or something? Man, check out what we did. After school, man, I used to have a, a carton of eggs and shit. My my little buddies, we'd just be bombing kids on the way. Every kid walked, them pedestrians, oh, they got it, bro. Hell yeah. Man, we tore their ass up. I knocked down about three mailboxes and shit. They got they called the police on me, but I got away. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Drove back the next day. We we used, we used to do something like that that was similar whenever we was in high school and this dude on a football team used to give us rods home right yeah. he was a white guy named Gangzar and we, he had a uh, he had a two door I think uh, like Grand Prix right and what we would do we'd be like hey go because uh, two of us got to get dropped off in the hood and then he had to go circle around so we'd go through the hood and we would put our seat all the way back so they couldn't see us and they just saw him we'd be like. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hey. Oh, shit. That's a good move. And he would do it every time, even though he knew we were going to do that shit. Yeah, but he man. wouldn't get fucked with because he was with us. But. Yeah. <laughs> she the thing about what we did, we did this shit in the dead of the summertime. That egg could hit you and it stay on you till you get in the tub. You know? Oh, man. That's horrible. Oh, that shit stank. They got my ass back, though. My dad, he had an orange Volkswagen uh, station wagon. You seen those Volkswagen station wagons? Oh, what year? Uh, 1973. Ooh, I think I know what you're talking about. You said orange Man, station Man, my wagon? dad was so fucking ghetto. I love him to death. Good dad, he raised me right. But he would drive, all, like, say for instance, this is the school building. This is right the school building. He would drive all the way up to the damn door. You can open the door and just hop right in the car. I said, damn, who drives in the grass and shit? Oh, no, damn. Not that. No, uh, Volkswagen station oh, wagon. Oh, Volkswagen. Okay. Yeah. What's that first word? That's, that's their Volkswagen. That's their station wagon. Orange. Damn, Jason Friday 13th <laughs> be driving. Close now. <laughs> Hell yeah. Volkswagen. That? Hell yeah, right there. The fourth, four, <laughs> the fourth car. The fourth one right, right there. there. Yeah. Damn, Ooh, dude. That's dope as hell. Man, he used to pick us up in that shit. We used to get in the car, be mad as hell. Because it was ugly back then. Man, that's good. Everybody looking at you, boy, coming straight out to school, hopping in the car. He would go to the back door. Damn. Uh huh. That, you, that looks like the you shortest want to drop you, bus drop you off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's the car you had right there, that orange one. You want to drop you off a, a block before? Damn. Man, that car, I remember that car, bro. Was it like Uncle Buck? You remember when he would drop like, drop that girl off on Uncle Buck in 1989, and then like uh, he would his car would be farting and shit, and then like he, he, he made it loud so everybody like in the school could know that that car was like hers. What the hell is he talking about? <laughs> <laughs> you never seen I'm that? I'm glad you're the first guest to say that. You are the first one. Hold on, I'll show you. Hold on. Let me show you. 1989. Look. <laughs> Uncle Buck. The hell, I ain't heard that story you never ever. Seen Uncle Buck? <laughs> <laughs> Most people are like. Right here. Look, look see like, right here. Like, like when he drops, he in the movie, he drops her off the to school. Like It's that has a bell on it. Yeah, it's like when he drops, he, in the movie, he drops her off to school. Like, it's, it's that has a backfire on it. Yeah, so and it, like okay. It's like, it's like he said it was shit. farting. Yeah, he's dude, trust me. When you see it, you'll be like that. That car. What's the name of the movie? Uncle Buck. You got John Uncle Candy. Buck. Mike Epps made a remake to it. He did. Uncle Buck. Oh yeah, he it was sure a did. TV show. Yeah. I guess I got to look for that. Dude, you need to. It's Uncle classic. Buck is a great movie. This movie right here is the shit. It's it looked a, like it's pretty John good. Candy. Is that Uncle Buck with the black hat on in the middle? Yep. Yeah, John, John Candy. Candy. You remember him? Oh, I remember John Candy. Remember when he did Boston Millions? Yeah, yeah, he passed away. Man, he was a great comedian too. Here go the car. Oh yeah, that's it. That's my dad. Up here, here it is in the dark. You can still see the flames too, man. Yeah. One thing about the Where's Volkswagen, the my dad yeah. used to cruise and he drove slow. Because oh, he man. smoked weed and shit back in the mm-hmm. day. I ain't know about it until I went to his shoebox. You ever, your mom and dad ever have a secret closet, some of their closet secret? You, mm-hmm. know, you might run into it. It might be a liquor stash. You know, it might be where his gun is. You know, all that stupid stuff as a kid. You go search. Like me. When I found out it, it wasn't no Santa Claus and shit. It was amazing because I found all the toys. Yeah. And shit. Ooh. Mom hit the toys. And shit. How, you know, uh, how old? How old? Yeah. How old were you when you found out? I was, was probably no... about probably about nine or ten. Oh, thank God. What? Same, Same man. They said that's something wrong <laughs> with that. <laughs> the struggle is real when you find <laughs> your parents say, "Shit, I gotta go." Nine or ten years old. <laughs> yeah, because I found out. Man, why well, used to be sneakers a motherfucker? I used to be, you know, that's... Christmas Eve. You supposed to be in the bed waiting for your parents. Yeah. Waiting oh, for Santa man. Claus to come. Oh no, nah, nigga. I slept with one eye open. I was like, shit, something going on in there. I was go <laughs> peek through cracks and shit, seen them moving bicycles and presents and shit. I said, damn, that's who Santa Claus is. That's what drew damn. me to go look in this closet. Uh-huh. Uh, someone in that closet right there. They they keep going in that damn closet. I'm going in there. And I seen all them gifts in there, man, buried up under the clothes and shit. I like, hell yeah. Damn. You don't think that's old, nine or that's ten? Not to, old. To, to know that Brandon, he didn't have the internet, man. Come on, yeah, man. no Neither access. The only, only I. I still, that's still not a reason. How, how old were you when you find either. out? Let's see. Let me see. I mean, I can't even remember. It, it couldn't, it couldn't have been anything past. Dom found out in Afghanistan. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I would Afghanistan, have to be like six like, or something, that? six or seven. No. There's no way it was anything past that. Yeah, I think no. I was probably like seven or eight. I, I give or take, I might, what grade is I, that? I might be like third grade. I might be yeah. off a little bit. It's someone around that age group, bro. Right, fourth mm-hmm. or fifth grade. I remember that. Uh, no, did y'all when y'all went trick or treating as a kid? Did your parents used to hide the candy and shit? My mom wouldn't let us go trick or treating. Oh man, it was mean. Damn, as hell. for real. Mm-hmm. Damn man. Because yeah, of that damn Christian religion. 
Well, my my grandparents weren't like that, man. We got to go trick or treating. We just yeah. couldn't wear any costumes that were like sacrilegious or like devil worshippers. Mm, like well, yeah. I had to go as like a penguin and shit, a <laughs> banana, George Bush, yeah. good Christian icon. Yeah. W. And I, when I was young, shit, we didn't have no money, shit. We just put sheets over our head, cut holes in. I can't do that. With the eyes. Oh, no, you can't. <laughs> Yeah, I like that. Though. We couldn't do that one, dude. And try, trust me, we had them. We just couldn't do it. Dude, I got cut off on Halloween, man, one time because uh, I was in a Mario suit in second grade, and somebody opened the door, and they were like, you want some candy? As soon as she opened the door, she had a Yorkie. And the Yorkie came charging at me. This is why I was still terrified charging. of the dogs. So, dude, I'm just in her yard, just running for every fucking thing, yeah. not giving a fuck, terrified. And uh, then when I got in the car, they were like, you're not doing shit else. So sit back and watch all these other kids get candy. Man, I, I, I met your mom today. You yes, got a cool you mom, man. Thank you, man. I'm I met glad. Brandon's mom. She came to uh, the open mic I host. Um, What's that called? It's the first open mic with a twist. And uh-huh. when I say a twist, you have two different uh, sectors of the show. First show, first set, you got three minutes set to do. Second mm-hmm. set, you have uh, two minutes and you can improv. And she came. We had a good damn time. She tell you we had a good time. Oh yeah, man. She was like, yeah. She was like, she had a blast. And then yeah, she explained how she met Dante and stuff. It was cool. Yeah, we tried to call this nigga. He answered the phone and shit. Uh-huh. He, he all he's with his family. I said that's a lot because family right here. No, I'm out on a date with my girl's family. We were at dinner. <laughs> this nigga said he with his family. This family over here. <laughs> hey, Brandon, what what'd your mom say about Dante? Oh yeah, she was like, she was like, man, I. I I saw this dude early. He was built, and it was like some gay dude. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> and then she was like, oh, and then when I explained, she was like, oh, yeah, that's him. But Man. I was like, you're not gay. No, Dante. So describing Dante as built when he has an active <laughs> limp, <laughs> his lie. knee blew out. Dante is looking for love, bro. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's looking for love. <laughs> he don't find yeah, it, he's, he's casting a wide net. Yes. Dude. I ain't going to lie. <laughs> Man, oh. I, I, I can't wait to see him kiss. I know his kiss from <laughs> I know they they, can't wait to see him. What? That kid, that kid's gonna be strong as hell. Whoever he kids. <laughs> that is gonna be a strong. He gonna kiss. suck they that fucking face. That's what dude. I should say that. What? Like of uh, mice and men, where he squeezes the fucking rat. Because he loves. Kisses are like. That nigga gonna kiss somebody strong as fuck. <laughs> oh shit! I'm talking about this. He gonna suck they damn face off. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And tongue kiss. Oh shit. Cause you know <laughs> he gonna want oh, to French kiss somebody. Oh, he gonna want to use the tongue, tongue is yeah. coming out for oh, yeah. sure. Yeah, he ain't, oh, yeah. he ain't gonna be no. So, ladies, if you get your first kiss from him, just know the tongue gonna come out first. Hell yeah! He, yeah. And he gonna lick you in the face and then just grab you. And we're gonna set that date and uh, show up here on Clown yeah. Palace. Yes, we are. <laughs> I think we have to. Now. If he can make it, we need a good lawyer. Though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we'll need a good lawyer. He oh, gonna yeah. fucking finesse the hell out there, girl. <laughs> or she's gonna finesse him. You know, it's amazing when he get a girl. It probably change his whole persona. His own personality. The dude, because we just was on a show with this dude named JT, and he said Dante has been like that his whole life. I can believe it. But he's natural. He's he, he's <laughs> he's natural. <laughs> I ain't mean natural, but he, <laughs> <laughs> he he's honest. And what's the word I want to say? Not honest, but genuine. Gen- genuine. Oh, genuine. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah. A hundred percent. No, he no, fake. no. He's genuine. He's the he, most genuine. He may be the most genuine most. person. And, and man, most. he yeah. I, you have to be born like that. And, and if I could say. If Happy was a person, <laughs> that'd be that nigga right there. Uh, yeah, 100%. Yeah. Even when he's sad, literally. Yeah. Oh, Even yeah. when he's sad. A good dude. Man, listen, man. He's a great guy, man. Great Oh, cool. hell yeah. And, and, and y'all guys, y'all good, too. I like the fact that all of us kind of started together. It's, mm-hmm. it's crazy. Yeah. Over at the uh, at your open mic out there in Madison. Lock That's where off. I first started. Yeah. Oh, God. You and... Uh, What's his name? Moved to Alaska. What's his name? Jalen. Yeah, that was some good times, man. Just meeting the guys. Miss you, Jalen. Miss you. Yeah, yeah. R.I.P. Yeah. Dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not seeing. I I pull up. I seen fucking um, Jake Muncy and some Sorry, dude out there doing karate and shit. I was like, what the fuck is going on? They was doing karate moves and shit. <laughs> what? Did you Well, nobody hit. <laughs> Them niggas was this close. He just swinging and didn't nobody get hit. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Did Jake fight a homeless oh, guy? He was, you were the, was that uh, when him and Nico go down? Man, it was swinging like a motherfucker when nobody can touch. I was like, God damn, that's the first fucking fight I seen where the side, everybody on the sideline got hit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
So, Mike, you got you got to finish explaining the dish. So you do the first part of stand up. Yeah, the first part of stand up. Second part is improv. Uh-huh. So you get to come on stage, and if you want to, you can do a two minute set. If you want to do something else, or you could choose a person to do improv with. So it's fun because you can get up there and just you know. We, and normally, what I do is I I give them a subject, or the crowd give them a subject, and they reenact whatever it is that they want to improv. So it's cool. It's and really fun. You don't got nothing like it out. There's no other mic like that here. It's a good time. And you want to come see it. They got good food. Yeah. Oh, they got good food. Oh, yeah, the dish. Where's it at? 2005 Pool Drive, right Two, off the, North Memorial Parkway. Hell, yeah. And, and I know that you can do something else there, and, and I want you to take us out with this. Uh, you freestyle, right? Ooh. Hell, yeah. Come on, now. Oh, shit. Who, who, who could do a beat? Me. Come I on. Definitely. I hooked you up. All right, you ready? Mm-hmm. Are oh, he going to beatbox? He going to beatbox. Hold up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now we at the clown college, not community college. And you see, I'm full of knowledge. And everybody know that I ain't garbage. Sometimes I feel like it. This motherfucking beat got me shaking. <laughs> got me feeling like the earth is quaking. Uh. Not because the beat is tough. Cause his breath smell like some fucking. He over there, he beat for real. Just let him go. I lost. I Brandon lost, can't hear you right now. I lost fucking track. <laughs> uh, nigga, bring that beat back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would do the. I, I, man, let's just fuck my freestyle up, bro. That wasn't free right there. That was bondage. <laughs> Wait, I'm better with the pencils. If you got a pen, where they go? Right, so, for the love of God, somebody find a pencil right now. Oh, pencil, dude. There those. should be two over there. I can do those way better. One by you? Like, yeah. I'll get you a real beat right here. Y'all hope ain't messing up y'all's podcast, bro. Fuck no. no. You're making it better, dog. This is no, fun, oh, dog. Hey, man. This is the best no, no, episode on, we've baby. ever had. We outside. Okay. Oh, you can anybody? do a one and you two. Hey, I used to be box. Anybody else huh? got anything? I used to be box. Pen over there. Go ahead. Check it out. Hold up. Let's see. Let's see. Oh. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Brandon, start yeah. freestyling. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rapping in college. Got the fair. Ah. Hold on, wait, wait. Ah, ah. Okay, hold on. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep hey, going. like that shit was hard, though. Yeah. That was good, dude. Hell yeah. Rapping that college. Got the big mileage. Come around here with my big old mileage. Coming down here with the big old silence. Coming down here with the big old Tyler. Yeah. Tyler the creative fan. I got. I got a big old pan. I'm the man. Wearing the tan. Playing with plan. Coming on down with them big old legs. Yeah. And look up top, we got the big old head. Yeah. What? Got no dress. Not Ted. Come around there. I'm special head, huh? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I got you. I got you. Oh my God. You're in class. I know you felt it. You niggas out there, you're wearing helmets at the desk. <laughs> your best. Dude, I actually got a football helmet I can bring you next he time. Said you <laughs> like, I got my personal helmet for real. Gotta... Y'all, you know what? Something else when you get ready to do your work and the teacher say, Y'all, let's say a prayer. Because y'all motherfuckers are going to work me to death. <laughs> I was a special ed. You were? <laughs> Was oh you in spe- Hold on, man. Hold I'm on. Was you in special ed or special needs? Man, I'm gonna tell you what's crazy. I uh-huh. was in special ed English. Okay. But I was in like <laughs> geometry, math. Oh. I was backwards in the motherfucker. Yeah. I had took human physiology, but I was in special ed reading. How the fuck <laughs> they do that? The <laughs> government was just making money off me. I was kind of. That's all it was. How are you gonna have somebody? In a, Did you get a check? I was in two. Spe- I was in two special classes: special smart uh-huh. and special ed. <laughs> Smart and dumb at the same damn time. Did you get a check for it though? No, nah, I ain't get no, oh, check. no check. So yeah, you no. wasn't all the way down in there. No, nah, they get checks for being like that. Yeah, my, bo- my boy, my boy got a check. <laughs> for Glendale, being dumb, Glendale, Glendale Walker. He got being a- dumb, you get a check, huh? I know. One thousand percent. He got it. He got a check every month. Well, his mama got it. And there then, was some special shit going on. Yeah, right yeah. Now. Somebody was putting some money. in it. Is he smart? Is he no, put- he's in special ed. Like he, uh, he some- get, he's so. He, <laughs> It's like it's like when you. <laughs> no, the reason I'm saying that because some schools get money when they put you in special ed. Uh huh. And, and back in the '80s and the '90s, they put a lot of black boys in special ed. Uh huh. Oh. Cause the best football players and fighters and shit was in special ed. <laughs> we had a running back that was in our special ed class. He was like, shit, running like a motherfucker. Uh-huh. On him. But, but he just it, couldn't do words and such. Nah, he would be reading his words and shit, and mm-hmm. he'd get to a word he didn't know. He said, "Big word." <laughs> oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> such and such, this is that big word. And guess what happened? Guess what, he said? guess what happened when he said big word? What happened? What? Everybody repeated big word. <laughs> oh, now sound it out, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, hell yeah. That's fucking wild. Lincoln. Lincoln. Dude, I had to do that also. <laughs> Did you have to read the like old people sometimes? Man, we had a Dick and we had a uh, Dick and Jane book. That's how I learned to read. <laughs> hey, let me what grade was you in when you read Dick and Jane? These dudes in special ed class turned into a poem fucking story because they just know the name of the book. You know, with some funny ass niggas, they're funny as fuck too. Comedians they make a oh, porn out of this right yeah. here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Man. Fun that's with Dick I, and Jane. That's where the movie came from. This book. I've never yeah. seen the this movie. This book was. It was like the Curious George. You know Curious George. Yeah, I know the Curious man George. with the big hat. Uh huh. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, it was that. next up. Was, um, <laughs> can you read that right now? Yeah, I can. Perfect. Yeah, you can get that. The ick and. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, they're gonna pay you uh, right there. <laughs> Oh, look, Dick. Look, Jane. Look and see. See, baby. See, see. Oh, 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 Dick. Look and see. See, baby. <laughs> that is wild. Man. That's that weird as shit. I couldn't read. That. Oh, Dick. Could, I'm good. Could you imagine? They even had a store called Moby Dick. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. I remember that. The one. Great White Whale, dude. Yeah. Just Who like the my hell, car. Why is Dick always in the. You said Dick was. Was that you with the Richard joke with the Dick? I don't That's think so. Charlie. Yeah. That's Charlie, Charlie, yeah. Charlie Swisher. Yeah. The other Sw- white. Yeah. Yeah. That's our how did it get Richard and Dick crossed up though? What? I don't know. That I don't know weird. how that came. That's why I want to name Google that shit. It's like James and Jimmy, dude. Yeah, right, let's James, see. Richard Jim. and Dick. How did it, Richard doesn't have an I C K in it? Right, let's see. Right. Uh, Richard yes, and does. Dick. Mike, what Mike, you know, fridge has the letter D in it, but refrigerator okay. doesn't have the letter D hmm. in it. Ah, okay. okay. Damn, that's. Let's see. Dick is a nickname most often for Richard, mm-hmm. which likely originated in the Middle Ages as rhyming slang for Rick, as did William, Will, Bill, and Robert, Rob, Bob. The association with penis is more <laughs> recent, arising from Dick becoming a, cli- <laughs> a cliche name for any man. <laughs> and then Tom, Dick, Tom, and Harry. Dick and Harry, yeah. So, they, fuck, that's crazy. They crossed their name up with a real dick. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He was a dickhead, wasn't he? he was oh, like, yeah, man. Somebody didn't nobody like. Go name my kid Richard. Rick you and should. Dick. Thank you. Damn, Dick Willis. Was, yeah. Just thinking the 1800s, that was wild <laughs> as hell, wasn't it? You said the 1800s? It was at the 1800s? Uh, no. I think they did it like It said Middle 17. Ages. Middle Ooh, Ages a little bit before 15, the 1800s. 15, 1600. 15, 16. <laughs> a little bit. This is a tad. Yeah. So how far back do the word dick go? Oh, dude. Let's uh, Let's see. Because, dude, so, I know it goes back ages. So, I wonder, was that word used, oh, can I suck your dick? You no, know, they said the that's newer. No, that's they new. Saying, they said it's new. So, what did they call penises? I didn't mean to say that like that. No, it's that's not right. We you know who, penises. That, you don't have to. Can Ooh, I just say I, mean, I know, I'm fucking with y'all. <laughs> okay. Like, y'all got a bunch of Christians watching your podcast, and it's like. There's not a one, I the guarantee Catholic, This is the Catholic's number one fucking <laughs> podcast. <laughs> I just got Jews. Baptist and yeah. Probably a big, huge <laughs> Jewish fan base is what I'm guessing. Oh, yeah, dude. This podcast is ran by the Baptist Association. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, we were opening up the Book of Criminals. <laughs> <laughs> well, the Book of Numbers, sorry. Uh, <laughs> Can you turn to the Book of Judges? <laughs> Yo, so that word started in mid 17th century. Dick mm. became a slang for a man as a sexual partner. For example, in 1665, the English rogue by Richard Head, a dick pro occurred to impregnate a character that is having difficulty conceiving. His name is Dick Head. I, I heard that. <laughs> I heard that. Yo. He said this. He said, the next dick I pick up for her was a man of a color. As contrary to the former, as light is to darkness, being swarthy, for whose hair was as black as small, as slow, middle stuttered, well set, both strong and active. BBC. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. It's early <laughs> that's BBC. What it was BBC. <laughs> BBC. Yeah, that's old BBC. We were throwing it down back in the <laughs> medieval times. Damn, they strong. came on. They had a Mandingo back then. We got it. <laughs> Dick. Yeah. That's crazy, bro. It came from us, man. We got that dick. <laughs> in the 1500s. Hell yeah. Man. 17. Real black power. Yeah, yeah. 1700? It said 1700. It said 17th. 17th century. Wait, yeah, 17th century. The first time was 1665 in satire. Mm. Satire. The is, English uh, Rogue by Richard Head. Or Dick Richard Head. Head. Damn. 
Ooh, that's a Richard real Richard Head, you did say dickhead. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's what he looked like. He sure do look like He do look like a dickhead. He was freaky as hell. Oh, he probably was. <laughs> Imagine back in those this days. This nigga was a freak. I do. bet he cross-dressed, too. Look at that dress he got on. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. All right, Mike. Uh, the ghostly Muhammad Ali going back, that means we went over time because it was just so fun talking okay. to you, man. I'm sorry. Hey, no, no, no. That's, that's good. good. That's a good thing. All right, if you want to, uh, in this camera right here, you're going to say anything you got coming up, all of your socials. All right, cool. And where the, and where the people can find you. You can find me right here in Huntsville, Alabama. I've been a barber in Huntsville since 1994. The name of my barbershop is Mike and Bill's Presidential Barbershop. We're right here in Huntsville. You can find me on all social media platforms, 10, 10, 10 Stacks, 10 S-T-A-C-K-S-S. I host a mic at The Dish, which is on 2005 Pool Drive, Huntsville, yeah, Alabama, yeah. every first and third Monday. Y'all come check this shit out. My guy's right here from Clown Community College. <laughs> I said that shit again. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he's just stuck in my in my brain. Clown, I almost said it again. Yeah. Clown, I can't say it. God damn, <laughs> Clown College. There yeah. you go. Yeah. yeah, yeah, Clown College next to Alabama and him. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I host the open mic every first and third Monday. Y'all check us out, and I'm, and I'm appreciative of the co- podcast. Uh, and I don't know, what is this page baby you gave me right here? <laughs> nah, it was just all your socials and shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. You know, man. we got everything on there. Hey, they did their homework. So, y'all, man, y'all check out this podcast. It's up and coming. And this is the 38th episode, man. Kudos yeah, to yeah. y'all, man. And I'm looking forward to seeing y'all grow, grow, grow. Y'all, man, it'd be good if y'all, y'all need it. Y'all need, I can get y'all connected with some, a good, a good person too. Y'all might, you know. In fact, let me see. We're gonna talk about it. We're gonna talk about it off mic. Yeah. All right. Hell yeah. yeah. All right. Hell yeah. Hell hey, thank yeah. you so much, Mike, for thank coming you, Mike. on, man. No thank doubt. You. Hey, you the shit. Appreciate I mean, you, I man. Appreciate y'all. We out. Hell yeah. <laughs> we gotta have Charleston White on the podcast. You got that back? You don't have to record the screen, but uh, oh, don't have to see. Uh, I'm sorry, I got too excited. Hell you got that on? <laughs> yeah, this is on. All right. Put it up to the mic. <laughs> The back of the, this part. All right, yeah. <laughs> Your call has been forwarded to voice. Damn, dude. Let me, let me try. You got two phones. <laughs> got, got to. I'm sweating like Dante's about to go on stage. He may or may not answer, but I talked to him. He's a busy man. He's got a lot going on. A lot of people doing. What up, this Charles? Hello. What up, Charles? What's going on? Man, shit, chilling, man. Look, man, I'll call you. I got a, a group of guys. I got a group of my partners, man. Listen, I'm at a uh, commu- it's co- <laughs> Clown Community College, bro. And we want y'all that. We want to see what it takes to get you on the podcast, man. I'm going to shoot you my manager number. I bet, man. We they right. sitting here listening to you now, man. They it, it's a mixed group of guys, man. They love you, bro. I bet. I'm finna shoot you my manager number now. I bet. All right. This is the best day of my life. Oh, <laughs> my. This is the best day. This is the best day of my life. Oh, Fuck yeah, bro. That's crazy. Man. Man. No, no. <laughs> That's what we needed, dude. Oh, <laughs> man. My, I told you, my dude's connected. <laughs> what you just know him? Y'all know him. Man. Where'd y'all meet? <laughs> Where'd y'all meet? I met him, I met him at, a, at a comedy show. <laughs> oh. He gave me his number. Oh, damn. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. See, I, that's why I paid to get dressed up. I was dressed up and shit. He thought it was somebody big, whatever. <laughs> so that's that's what I did. We exchanged numbers and shit. Damn, bro. I got to take a page out of Mike's book. Oh. Yeah, I, I did. Yeah, Bra- yeah, Brandon I, I, cannot I, comprehend what's going on. Right y'all know Hill Harper? H- who? Google Hill Harper. Hill Harper. Okay, let's see. How you spell <laughs> Hill? H I L L. Mike, tell, tell Charleston you put a piece on for him. He wanted one. Yeah, t- uh, he, he need one. Well, uh, he on right there. Oh yeah, yeah, hell yeah. I used to oh, cut his from? He's from. Uh, He's from New York. The doctor. Yeah. yeah. Let me call him. Do you know him? Yeah. <laughs> he might be. Busy. <laughs> I've reached three. Ch- I'll believe it.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah y'all always got his number. Yeah. <laughs> that sound like Hold up. What, you cut his hair? We do. Yeah. Like when he came down here or you went to go see him? Oh, uh, he came down here. Mm. Y'all Google Double D. Double D is a famous comedian, too. Oh, I got you. He had a comedian, is he? Yeah. He is? No, uh, no, he's oh. an actor. He's running for senator in Michigan. It's not what? important, but is it screen recording, Brandon? That's Double uh, D right no, here. It's not oh, That'll be a good person to put on y'all podcast, too. I see him before. No, his name is <laughs> no, no. Double D. He's a famous comedian. Let's see. Who was, was that? that? Big like, Horn. Barbershop Expo, Mike. Where was Steve Harvey? He's my favorite thing. Uh, Barber was there. Oh, yeah. You seen that? Wait, yeah. Exotics or something. There's like a whole bunch of people. Was there too? No, I got I, like I got Diddy's. Oh shit! Diddy's, what? Diddy's barber. Uh, <laughs> that's my partner. <laughs> hey, I, I got the number for y'all. You said Diddy's Diddy barber? barber? No, for Charles's uh, manager. He yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. That's whatever it takes. He's on next week. Let's whatever it takes. Fuck whoever else was supposed to be on. That, dude. Well, nobody was. So, <laughs> so right, write dude. it down. Hey, Brandon, you got yeah. a pen over there, dude? Shit, yes, I oh, do. Holy shit. Yeah, I told y'all I'd get y'all hooked up, bro. Hell no. Nah. Yeah. You ever be calling him? Just talking to him? Yeah, I call him from time to time. He'll call me. For real? Yeah. He'll call me, man. He'll call me, say some random shit, crazy as hell. <laughs> I want my man weave nigga hang the phone up and shit. <laughs> yeah, I'll be like, yeah, this nigga crazy. <laughs> Well, hell yeah, we go. We you didn't believe you didn't believe all your shit. Y'all didn't believe that shit. Y'all just heard that shit was crazy. Just, at first, at first, I heard his voice. I'm like, "There's no way that's Charleston." But then I heard it again. I was like, "Oh, that, damn, that's yeah. wild." Thanks, Mike. Hell yeah, yeah. damn, that's dude. Crazy. Yep, that's fucking wild. A little uh, encore. Yeah, a little encore. Oh, for the episode, post credit scene. Oh yeah, did y'all yeah. record that? Did y'all yeah. record? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's I'll dope. Oh,